But yeah, welcome to the stream everyone. I hope you're all doing good. So you might have noticed my stream looks a little bit different today. I think my stream got a haircut. But yeah, um, new starting screen. This is why I'm still uh, sort of sticking here rather than go to my layout just yet, like my game layout. Just to show you the new artwork for my streams when I start my streams from now on. Again, like my previous starting intro uh, artwork, it was made by Chod314231. You can see it down there. I commissioned him for this. I commissioned a lot of stuff from him recently, specifically for streams. So this isn't the only asset you'll be seeing. There's other stuff, but we'll get to that over time. There's, uh, there's like a BRB screen, there's like an ending screen, and there's like a, a please stay tuned or... Please stand by, sorry. Like, that's the thing when there's, like, technical issues. So I will show all of those when I stream today, so you can keep an eye out for those ones. But yeah, why am I doing... Why am I, like, changing all of this? Why is everything different? Well, I got a new PC built, and that's why I've not been streaming for the past week. Like, it's been a full week, pretty much, since I streamed Super Mario World Randomized, which was the last thing I streamed. And shout out to Deej Bruce, he helped me put together my new PC, and for both him and me, like, it was a bit of a, a, a trial and error process. Like, I've built a PC before, I'm just not super experienced with it. Deej has more experience with me, and even he was struggling, like, to get some of the stuff put into place. Like, the cooler, specifically, was, like, the trickiest thing to install, because it's not, like, a conventional cooler. But yeah, it was it was kind of a, a bit of <laughs> it was a bit of an issue. We'll just say that. But it, I finally got everything put together. Like I, he did most of the building, and I did the wiring at the end. And after that, I had to do a clean install of Windows Ten because I couldn't load up my previous Windows Ten installation for some reason. But thankfully, I've got all of my stuff migrated more or less. Like not everything, but enough. Uh, necessities that I needed for streaming purposes, so everything is pretty much how I like it, more or less, and it's pretty good. Why are you playing GTA? Partially because I want to break in my new GPU and, you know, play like a graphically intensive game on stream at the same time. Because my, my old hardware was like a GTX 1080, which is a decent GPU, but obviously it's starting to show its age a little bit. I got an RTX 3080 Ti for those wondering. I'll talk more about the full specs while I play the game, but yeah, uh, I guess we'll get started in a second. Just uh, quickly checking something here. I'll show you the gaming overlay. It doesn't look any different layout-wise, but you'll obviously notice some a little bit of a visual change. Nice little bit of a background galaxy thing going on there. I'm not sure if that's the Milky Way or not, but it looks nice. But yeah, this is my... I will probably be... This is a work in progress, by the way. This isn't, like, the final overlay, because it's mostly using the old overlay. It's just with a different background. I'm going to be configuring this over the next couple of days, so this will probably change in near future streams, but for now I just wanted to at least give it some sort of a facelift so we got a nice background to go with that. Right, okay then, so Grand Theft Auto 5. See, I've considered streaming Grand Theft Auto 5 for a good few years now, and one of the things that I was thinking would make me stream the game is if it came to Switch. Like, I already had the game on PC, but it would have been nice to have it on the Switch, but, you know, Rockstar being, like, kind of EA, it's like, oh, we, we don't know if we want to commit to this platform, so... Okay, the game's capturing, that's good. Don't worry, that's not police... Uh, that's not the police outside trying to capture me or raid me or something. Uh, that's just uh, the game making those noises. But yeah, uh, seem like we're for over four years into the Switch's life and Rockstar's done jack shit. So at that point, I'm just like, yeah, fuck it, I'll, ju I'll just play the PC version. Plus, I've got a new GPU to, like, really push this. That said, the game will be running at 
a relatively small resolution, 720p, because I stream at 720p, because internet reasons. So it's not going to look... Mute icon still up? Oh shit. Hang on a second. Yeah, that that is... I didn't realise that that wasn't fixed. One second, please. I can fix this. Just going to take me an extra minute to do so. I had a feeling that at least one thing wasn't properly configured, but I know how to fix this, so let me just do that real quick. Almost done. Right, let's see. Will this work? Yep, that works. Well, it does work, but only partially. One moment, please. Sorry for <laughs> sorry for this, like, not... See, that's weird. Oh, right, I see what's going on. I see. So that... Bear with me. Will I quickly sort this out? I know exactly what's going on, so you'll have to just give me one extra second. Set that to mute. Alright. Right, I think it should be working now. Let me just test that. Testing, 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 te testing, testing, testing. Right, that works. Excellent. Right, okay then. So, Grand Theft Auto V, um, I have played this game on multiple occasions. I have never finished the single player because it's like a really long single player game. But I love this game. Like, I got this way back day one on the Xbox 360. It is a classic. Like, undeniably. It's a really fucking good game. It's also a really intense game at times in terms of the story and the characters. I've never streamed a GTA game before, so this will be a first. So get ready for me to die a lot and, you know, cause mayhem. I'm just going to be starting a new save. I'm not going to be loading... Like, I had a previous save on PC, but I won't, like, do... This will be pretty much a full playthrough. Like, I'm going to eventually... See if I can try to do the entire game. It might take me a few months, but I'll get there bit by bit. Alright, everybody pays attention. No one gets hurt. Ah shit, subtitles are not on. I will fix that later. Actually, before we do that, there is a couple things I need to sorry. Professional st <laughs> My, my PC might be new, but I'm still as professional of a streamer as ever, with, like, you know, not taking into account certain things. The game will have subtitles, I just need to quickly do something else. There's more than one thing I need to, like, tend to. Again, I just migrated to a new PC, so not everything is configured exactly the way I want it, but I can fix this. I can fix it! I really need to watch Wreck-It Ralph again, that movie's good. Really good film. Gonna turn the volume up just a smidge. Okay. Right, now let's change subtitles. Sorry for, like, starting this in a very, you know, what's the word, like, disrupting the flow of things, but it should be, like, smooth sailing after this. Subtitles. On. There we go. Oh, wait a minute, how do I... Does it just apply? Okay, there we go. Come on, in the back. Hands behind your back. Come on, Mister. We're giving you everything. So yeah, just immediately starting off with a fucking heist. Get in there. Sit tight. I'll handle the plastic. Don't blow yourself up. Pay attention. Target mode can be altered. In the closet. In the back. Come on. What's he doing? Hurry. So how does the game look on the stream? Is it fine? 
Thankfully, I've not dropped a single frame since starting. Like, I thought my internet was going to start acting up tonight, but I think I just had to restart the router once to fix that. Use the phone to trigger the explosive charge. Press up. Detonate. I didn't know you could detonate, like, I guess it's technically possible through, like, radio waves or something, but yeah, detonating a bomb with your phone, that's kind of weird. Also, I cannot run during this part, I'm just walking. I mean, if you're, like, you know, stealing money from a bank, you think you'd be running and doing all this shit quickly, but no, let's just slowly walk our way there. 95,000, 179,000, nice. Uh, oh. Right, I see. Tell me you want to live. Work this Fuck! He didn't have to do that. Let's get going. There'll be time for grieving later. Yeah, you got that right. Come on. Okay, now I can run. Have you ever heard of Postal? I've heard about that game. I've never played it, though. But in that game, you just, like, kind of run about and do shit, don't you? Use RB to cover. Hang on. I think I have postal too. Find some cover. Oh, I have to go over here, right. Sorry, I'm not really paying attention to the tutorial. I was looking at chat. I'm playing with an Xbox One controller plugged into the PC, by the way. I don't really use mouse and keyboard for games like this. It's weird playing a game where the A button is run. Usually it's like the right analog stick button or something, or the left analog stick button. That's not reload. Right, okay, reload is B. X button makes you roll dodge. I forgot how you crouch. Oh. Yeah, I probably should be using the cover system. I'm not... Okay, that's better. Oh, Jesus. Wow. Left click on the analog stick. Wait, that actually does make you run? See, the tutorial was like, oh, press A to run. Leave it up to me to die at the fucking tutorial of all places, but you know what, whatever. Oh, it's the crouch. Oh. I mean, it doesn't look like I'm crouching, but I'm going slower, so I'm assuming that is crouch mode. You know, I don't think I've ever died at this tutorial area from, like, previous, like, playthroughs of this. My excuse is, it's been a while, and, <laughs> you know, I'm getting a feel for the controls. Where's that? Where's that guy? Come here. Oh, that was a bad idea. 
time for another episode of Good Idea, Bad Idea. There we go. Switch the most relevant character. Oops. Shit. Also, I wasn't paying attention to the tiny text at the top corner of the screen. Am I supposed to go somewhere? Like, is there a car that I need to hijack? Because I tried hijacking that car. Or do I just have to, like, go through these guys first and then find the car? Again, it's been a while. Hopefully my whole playthrough won't be DSP levels of bad, so you'll have to forgive me for my... for my rustiness and crustiness. Nah, it seems like I've just got to push through these guys and then we'll be good. Oh. We got a window. Let's go. Let's move it. Wait for the crew. There we go. If you're on the Xbox controller, you want to enable auto aim. I'll do that in a second. Also, I love that character. I think I think his name is Trevor. He's quite a fun character in this game. Honestly, I don't remember the name of the main protagonist, like the one that's in the the front passenger seat. Like Trevor is the most memorable thing about this game. And you'll see why. Alright, like, I guess we'll go to the chopper. We're getting there. I kinda half falsed that Arnie impression. I was, you know, didn't really want to commit to that. That did not look like I was going to make that, because of the way I slowed down right before that cutscene started. Fuck! Come on! Ditch the car, alright? We can go this way to the chopper. No! Hey! Stick to the plan! What? Stick to the fucking plan! Come on! So yeah, game's running at a solid 60. I need to check something with OBS once I get a moment to do so. Is the stream looking smooth, by the way? Because I'm not sure how things are looking right now for you guys. I'm assuming it's still smooth. It's not choppy or anything. I ask because I know that Vinny, when he gets new hardware, sometimes there's like issues. I think it might be an XSplit thing for him, which I don't use XSplit, I use OBS. I guess now would be a good time as any to change... Uh, yes. Wait, what? Wait, what did I change? No. I 
don't believe I changed anything there, but the game was like, oh, you made some changes, and I'm like, no, I didn't. I'm just going through the settings. Right, so get get the fuck out of here. No. But why why is the sorry the menu's not cooperating with me? You have to give me a second. Uh I'm gonna use the mouse because the controller is being weird with the menus. Game pads. Maybe it's under game? No. Oh wait, here we go. Targeting modes. Is it auto? Yeah. Oh wait a minute, this isn't the other thing. You've chosen a lock-on targeting mode in GTA Online, you'll be matched. Oh, right, okay then. Not going to be playing GTA Online, so that doesn't matter. So... I'm going to set it to partial. I don't want babby mode. So I'll have it like auto-aim just a little bit. Like I still want to feel like I'm actually doing something. So we'll do it like that. We'll meet it in the middle. You fucking cocksucker! Kill me, you prick! All right. Michael was not always a good husband. <laughs> not always a good citizen. Oh yeah, the guy's name is Michael, isn't it? But he was a man. Our Lord was crucified with two thieves. So perhaps You know at some point I should check out Red Dead Redemption. Which I've never played. I've only played GTA games and I haven't even played all of them. I've played like about half of them, including this one. We do not know your infinite mysteries, but we know that you will show mercy to our friend. Yep, faked his death. So, yeah, Michael, I, I forgot what his last name was. He is like the main character of the story but there is two other characters and one of the really cool things about this game is there's like three Your different like knows. intertwining stories going He's on at the same kid. time and you can switch between them at any time a good kid a, a good kid why does he help the fucking poor no he sits on his ass all day smoking dope and jerking off while he plays that fucking game if that's our standard for goodness then no wonder this country's screwed and what about you? Keep in mind, this game was like... This game came out, like, what, almost ten years ago? Imagine, like... Imagine his thoughts on, like, the country nowadays, <laughs> like, after what happened last year. 2013, yeah, so we're coming up with decades. And you consider them achievements? These were the opportunities I had. At least I took them. And where did these opportunities get you, Michael? They got me right... Fucking here! The end of the road! With a big house and a useless kid, and I'm stuck talking to you because no one else gives a shit. Oh, I'm living a dream, baby! And that dream is fucked. It is fucking fucked! Can you guys hear this? Like, I would turn the volume up, but if I, I, I alt-tab, the game goes silent. It's one of those PC games. Oh. Well, I think that's all we have time for. The same time next week? I guess. Oh, so that guy looks like like the guy we're like talking to right now. Just looks like a little bit like mm. Bob Ross, just with a smaller oh, afro. <laughs> Overriding futility is a vital part of the process. Embrace it. Whatever you say. Doc. You guys can't see the Steam overlay, can you? Like the Steam overlay thing telling you that people are like signing in. No, right, goods. Yeah, I don't. I don't want that stuff to appear. 
So yeah, even like almost 10 years on, this game is still a really nice looking game. Like when this game first came out, it was only on the Xbox 360 and PlayStation 3. The PC port didn't come out until like several years later. I think the PC port came out around the time when the PlayStation 4 and Xbox One ports released. Because this one has not only the standard Grand Theft Auto perspective, but you can also play it in first person for pretty much the whole game if you wanted to. PC port came out in 2014. Ah, right. Also, I was looking at the, the credits there, and somebody's last name was Oh No. Hey, excuse me, homie. Can you tell me where Berto Beach House is? No, homie, I cannot. Man, would you come on? <gasps> Actually, yeah. I believe that's the other character, Franklin. I think his name that's was. Right there. The one Downstairs. in the blue shirt. Yeah. Good looking out, homie. Appreciate it. Man, get your stupid ass on. Damn. Why don't you ask him if he knows the fucking owner? Or better yet. Do some skywriting and reads there's a couple niggas here about to boost some cars in case somebody uh oh he said the n words time for my twitch channel to disappear legit, <laughs> legit oh yeah i forgot huh 401ks tax returns and all yeah right you the one all pumped up on doing this lick nigga i'm getting my money in the hood i'm straight fool i'm cool you cool cool what slanging dope and throwing up gang signs yeah right whatever homie yeah, homie, this the spin knot right here. Your boy Simeon wasn't bullshit. Man, get your ass in me. You bring your ass, fool. Always trying to boss somebody. Come on. Come on. Shit, come on. Ah, shit. Here we go again. Baby dick. <laughs> yeah. And all this shit paid for with bad credit. <laughs> so, yeah, Lamar is the name of his friends. Which one you want, nigga? Uh, I'll take the red one. The red one looks nice. Like that? Bobby Big Dick on a nigga, huh? Shit for real, homie. Damn, this smoke How many times have they said the N word now? He should have paid the <laughs> this, this, this should be an N word count in the corner of the screen. Nah, I'm not gonna do that, but see what it do. Hey, hit me on the speakerphone, no? Oh, it's like that. For sure, homie. Oh shit. Well, I already fucked up because I didn't realise it was going to make that turn. Oops. So where did they go? D-pad for radio stations. Uh, this isn't copyrighted stuff, is it? Is that like a streamer mode so that I can turn that shit off? Like, I don't mind some music as long as it's not like you know, copyright shit. Okay, I'm I'm gonna do, do that now before I my stream gets demonetized and killed. Not not so much demonetized, but you know, why? Okay, so there's a fun thing with this game where every time I go into a different tab, it keeps saying this. You made changes but did not apply them, which is not true because I did apply them. Right, okay, so... Let me... Figure this out. If the game would be so kind. Right, audio... If anybody knows if there's a streamer mode, let me know and where to find it. Because I don't know where to find that shit. Uh, before I do that, actually, I'm going to quickly check something with uh, OBS. That's quite impressive. I've not dropped... See, when I talk about dropping frames, I usually refer to my internet dropping frames due to my internet starting to shit the bed. 
but there's like another kind of frame drop that goes on in the background due to encoding lag or rendering lag, which is something more on the GPU slash CPU side of things. Since starting the stream, I have not dropped a single frame on that front, so that's like really impressive for the new hardware I've got. Because if I was playing a game this intense, it probably would have dropped a couple frames as a result of like encoding lag. Right, well... Oh, wait a minute. Okay, well, I fixed that at least. Turn it upside down. Dialogue boost. Hear those soothing sounds? Oh, I see, it's for when they talk. That is from Australia. There's no streamer mode, just disable the radio. Yeah. Is there a good one that's just like talking or like, you know, jokes? Because I know there's a couple good ones in like Grand Theft Auto 3, but I don't know... Uh, which one is it? Because I'm kind of worried to stay on these for more than a couple seconds. West Coast talk. Did I pass that? Wait a minute. Sorry, I, I think I passed it there, but I didn't see it for some reason. West Coast Classics, no, that's not it. Ah, here we go. Oh, what the fuck? Right, there we go. Sorry about that. Right, let's continue. Oh yeah, you can do this for extra control. It's like a focus mode. Yeah, we gotta be careful with these raids. It says the guy who fucking drove up the side of a hill by accident. I forgot which button is the handbrake. I think it might be X or B. I'm not sure which one. Oh, Jesus. Might be A actually. I haven't properly figured that out yet. I did some benchmarking, like there's a benchmark tool in this game. I did some benchmarking before I streamed this. And the results were pretty good. It was hovering around 60 to 65 FPS. Oh Jesus. I thought I was going to land on top of him there. Oh, you can control your vehicle in midair. That's cool. Oh! You can add video game music to the music folder and have that play for future streams. Oh, that's a good idea. Yeah, I could do that. Just making sure that's the car I'm following. Like when I see a couple white cars next to each other, from a distance it's kind of hard to tell which is which. Next time I play this, I'm gonna like stream, like I'm gonna get my second monitor set up. Which currently it's not plugged in right now, long story short. Um, I've got a lot of video cables just like tangled all over the place and I haven't properly like reorganized them so as of right now I don't have access to my second monitor for this shit. I only use my second monitor for like capture card stuff. So what you see me streaming right now, I'm doing that on a single monitor like I'm playing the game in windowed mode and I've got like the chat next to it and OBS in the corner so I can see my stats. Whatever, nigga. I let some flow through your ass. Dog, I ain't too sure that joke works, dog. Oh shit. Ah shit. Oh, shit. Here we the go again. Guy. Okay, I'll stop cool, that now. Fool. We got the paperwork. Whatever. You explain that shit. I see I've you never played San Andreas, but I love that meme. That shit, my ass. Maybe someday I'll check that out. Oh, that's cool. 
Cinematic. Uh oh. I'm trying to see if I can cheese this a little bit. There we go. Later. I dinged my car a little bit, but it's fine. To lose the wanted level, stay out of the cones. Alright. Sometimes I may not be paying attention to that tutorial up in the corner there because I'm like glancing at chat while playing this. Keep that in mind. Okay, right, well, I've outran them. I need to just stay out of their sight for a couple moments now. I think I should be good. Oh, jeez. Did not mean to turn there. I'm just trying to get... Keep going in this direction. Also, I believe Frank... Uh, not Franklin. I believe uh, Michael's house is very close by. It's like a big manor. I'm not sure how long this goes on for, like I'm currently just evading until the stars go down. Okay, there we go. Right, we're good now. Yeah, it takes longer than I was expecting. It's just like you're evading for like a minute or something and then the stars go away. Before we... Before we go to our destination, I believe that manor up there, that big mansion on the side of the cliff, is like his, like, not my not my character's house, but it's like Michael's house. I believe it was somewhere up here. Like, I, I don't have the best of memories, but I vaguely recall it being somewhere in this general area. I'm going to have a quick look before I continue. Might not be this particular mansion. Like, there's a couple mansions around here, I think. Is this Michael's house? I don't think I can leave my car right now because I'm in the middle of this, but... It's not. Right. Yeah, I don't remember exactly where it was then. I'll see it when I get around to Michael's part of the game. Also, my car is really fucked up right now. The front of it's really, like, completely destroyed. Hey bro, you gotta be careful with those cars, okay? And then five minutes later, Franklin just destroys his car. Hey there, Green Yoshi guy. Welcome to the stream. So this is, for those that are just joining right now, this is my inaugural stream with my new PC that I got built. Really good hardware. Again, shout out to Deej Bruce for not only helping me build it, but also picking out the parts. He's way more knowledgeable about this stuff than I am. Like, he helped me pick out the parts for my last PC that I built five years ago, but he also helped me pick out the parts for this new one. So I pretty much took my old PC, uh, took everything out except for the hard drives and I guess the, the DVD drive and put everything new inside there. So it's the same casing and everything, but all, pretty much 95% of the internals are like brand new components. Nope. I didn't mean to pre press that button. Wacky waving inflatable arm flailing tube man over there. And I will not sell you this card. I will not. You make my skin crawl, you neo-Nazi. Hey, you are all the same. You're disgusting. This racist insulted me. Hey, what's up, boy? Who are you calling a nigger? No, no, I'm not calling nobody a nigger. Wait, what the fuck? I, I mean, N-word. I, I, that, that's not cool, man. I, I don't say that. You fucking right, and you better keep it right, because this man right here, he's an international businessman, a multiculturalist. That I could not have said better myself. Ah. 
But seriously, maybe he's not a racist. But I don't think that he is man enough for a car like this. Wait, wait a sec. <laughs> this guy right here, him? Get him a hybrid. That's a real man's car. <laughs> <laughs> I think you are right, Lamar. You get a tax rebate. I understand. Money is an issue, eh? Money isn't an issue. This is the best part. Watch this when he real or mean. He gonna get all this full money. Watch this. Look, man, I gotta go. <laughs> hey, Simeon, I'm out. I'll holler at you, homie. <laughs> it's the best part, man. So, Jimmy, are you sure you are man enough? Take the wheel and show me. <laughs> yeah, look at the fucking car. It's just okay. destroyed. Does this game have a photo mode? I think it does. How do you get access to that again? Uh... Yeah, I don't remember how you do photo mode. Phone. We fall through, homie? Uh, well, let's see. Oh yeah, that's right. It's like a camera phone. I forgot about this. That's cool. I like that. So yeah, it's just, just completely totaled from the front. And for some reason, Nels doesn't have a single scratch, even though I saw the fucking bastard just like scratch it a few times. Oh well. At least I'm not getting punished for it. You can take a selfie with the R stick. Oh, that's right, I forgot about that as well. Again, it's been years since I played this game, but yeah, there's, there's a lot of good shit in it. Yeah, here we go. <laughs> you can, like, do different poses and stuff, I think. Uh, I need to wait. Okay. That steam overlay was like blocking some of the buttons there. I couldn't see what it did. Uh, bother? Yeah. Filters. Right, okay then. So. Hold RT to use and use L and R to control head movement in self-portrait mode. And I didn't catch what that other thing said there. If anybody saw that, that last bit. Again, some, like... My excuse for not reading everything that's up in the top, top corner of the screen is, one, it's kind of small. And two, I'm, like, partially looking back at chat to see if anyone said anything. But yeah, let's, uh... Uh, is there a way to permanently have it in the same? Fuck! How, how do I do? How do I do this? Like I want it to always be the same radio station and not anything else. More dragons flying around upside. Enough of your renaissance. Fair speak. You're rid ridiculous. We have an inc right. I'm assuming that will always be the same now. Nope. Tch. Right. Well, I'll tell you what I'm gonna do. It may be a bit boring, but for the because. Twitch is fun. I'm gonna have to disable the music for now. Hold left on the D-pad. Is that how you do it? Yeah, you know more, more about this than I do. Ah, uh, da ba ba da ba. Gotta talk over that until I find it. Where is it? Where is it? Okay, hang on, hang on a second. It's the microphone. So, sorry for being paranoid, but Twitch can fucking kill your channel if you play licensed music. That's the thing that worries me. <laughs> Thanks, Twitch, for putting me on edge. Ah, there it is. Right, thank you. Oh, wait, did I pick the wrong car? The radar says it's that one. All right, let's go. Oh, 
Again, thanks for the help there. This jump change, I'm gonna knock a Oops. I'm gonna knock a bad grown and sexy bitch who ain't got a fat peas eye. Who you trying to impress? Your auntie Denise with all that ass nigga, she got ass. She grown, yeah. She grown into a fucking idiot. Nah, she's sexy. Sexy? She more like obsessed with sex, nigga. Nah, mad for the penis. That's exactly how I like my women. Man, shit, it's good to be home. Hey, get it. Oh, am I supposed to park it? Brown clubs where celebs like me and you hang out, finger groupies. Thanks, Laszlo. Thanks a lot. Listen, you're a cool guy. I love that you do that whole radio host thing. Really funny stuff. And normally, ugly guys sort of act all shy, but you've got lots of personality and you're. At least it remembers the radio station for the car you went in. Yeah, fuck you, I'll see you at work. Oh, nigga, don't hate me because I'm beautiful, nigga. Maybe if you got rid of that old yee yee ass haircut you got, you'd get some bitches on your dick. Oh, better yet, maybe Tanisha will call your dog ass if she ever stopped fucking with that brain surgeon the lawyer she fucking with. Nigga. I've seen that what? scene so many fucking times with mods with like different characters and shit. <laughs> like I've seen one with like Toad from Super Mario. Living on top of each other and it ain't right. Show, show, get on out of here. Okay. Oh god, there's like a political cartoon on. I think I remember that. I was on the phone, boy. Don't be listening. Goddamn freeloader. Sleeping on the bed. We'll save the game in advance time. All right. Pretty self-explanatory. Quick save buttons on the phone. Alright. Oh hey there Takumi, welcome to the stream. Also welcome back to Glasgow. I heard that you moved back in. So that's, that's fantastic. We'll have to hang out again at some point. Right, mission passed Franklin and Lamar. Only took me like 20 minutes but I finally finished the mission. I was mostly just dicking around, like, getting the fuel for the game again, because it has been years since I've last played this. Last time I played this, like, the PC version of this game was in 20... 2016? 2017? It was, like, at least four years ago. Rockstar Editor is available in the pause menu. Oh. Yeah, that's, like, a video... a built-in video editor thing. I'm not going to touch that. Are you cooking for me tonight, boy? Franklin! I was going down, huh? Hey, Nico! Let's go do some bowling, eh? Get over here so I can give you the new repo list. Alright, dog. I'll be around when I get a chance. God, that was one thing. Like, there was a... Like, I didn't like Grand Theft Auto 4 because there was a lot of things about it. A lot of little things that really got on my nerves. Like, I, I'm assuming, like... I'm sure it's a good game. But the biggest thing that annoyed me about that game, it wasn't even the biggest thing, it was like the second biggest thing, was that one guy that's constantly phoning you asking to go bowling. Like, that's kind of a meme. But here was my biggest gripe with Grand Theft Auto 4. So you'd, like, picture this, you're driving a car, you're like out chasing the cops or you want to go fast. You know, like a video game. But then you so much as slightly ding against something that like you, not like do a full on crash, but you'll like hit something that kind of like slows momentum down. You do that, you fucking crash out the windshield and you lose half of your health. And that just completely destroyed the flow of the game for me. That's why I don't like Grand Theft Auto 4. Like, that alone pretty much ruined the game for me. <laughs> like, I really couldn't continue playing after that. Thank God this game doesn't have that, we'll just say, feature. Right, so... What am I doing now? Do I have to, like, talk to my mother, I guess? Sorry, I'm just... More so looking at the chat and chatting myself, rather than, like, advancing. Again, I'll be DSPing this up a little bit, but I'll eventually... Oh, I haven't taken the da- I haven't taken damage yet. That's what happens in this game if you use bikes. See, with bikes, it's more understandable. But with cars? No. 
Oh, I have to say here, right. You certainly have a tough menopause, Auntie D. Didn't realize I was supposed to sit there. So yeah, I think that's like a political cartoon sort of thing. It's like satire. Wait, we only have two channels? Wow. <laughs> Press X to smoke. Like, I remember just spending hours on end just watching these weird fucking TV shows and cartoons and shit. Like, there is a lot of this content in this game. Yeah, I'm just smoking now. Right, well that was a nice little bit of inner monologue, right, I'm done with this. Need to go to Simon to progress. Alright. Where do I find my current objective? Like, how do you bring that up? I'm going to be asking these things a lot because I don't remember anything. I'm just trying different buttons. So yeah, there's... Obviously there's hand-to-hand -hand combat, but that's not the main part of the game. The main part is, like, shooting and driving. But you can punch people if, you so, if you're so inclined. I'm in free roam mode. I don't know what that means. You're not in a mission. How do I start a mission? Do I have to go back to that car place? Sorry, I was expecting the game. Yeah, right, okay. So I had the brain fart, I was thinking the game was going to be like, okay, go here next before you do your next mission, but no, you can do that whenever. Like, I, I know that's normally how Grand Theft Auto games work, but being the very start of the game with, like, tutorials, I thought the game was going to, like, guide me for a while. But no, after you do that, it's like, you can do whatever the fuck you want. Right, okay then, so, I'll go to the next mission and then maybe dick around for a bit. I'll see if I can get to Michael's part of the game, which shouldn't be too far in. I'm assuming Simon is the letter S there. Yeah, here we are. Am I in the... Yeah, I'm in the right radio station. Oh, so I'm just remembering the buttons. Alright. Gotta quickly check something. Again, I haven't dropped a single frame. I'm gonna move something over so I can see my OBS stats better. Oh yeah, this is... You can move it with the mouse as well, but I'm playing with the controller. Alright. Oh, shit. Wait, why is that? <laughs> I guess I need to go in through the back entrance. Adrian. Brother Adrian, welcome to the show. Hello, my child. My children, both of you. Welcome. Like 
Hey, what's up, Simia? My dear boy. There so we go. Good to see you. So good. Hold me. <laughs> yeah, look, man. Look, we've been working together for about a few months now, right? Which is why I am very honored Repossession. to announce to you. I think I remember this you mission. Our employee of the month, huh? Anyway, congratulations. It wasn't easy picking a winner. <laughs> yeah, me, Lamar, your nephew Sacha with the Twitch. Look, man, it's been a real honor, homie. But I gotta move forward in my life. It seems like all I do is let people tell me what to do and I do it and nothing changes. I tell you what, my boy. You tell me exactly what you want and I will very carefully explain to you why it cannot be. What? Today is repossessing vehicles that fools have purchased at exorbitant interest rates. But tomorrow, together, <laughs> I never had a black son. But if I did, I want him to be just like you. No, no, ah, nigga. Ah, <laughs> hello, What's up, Lamar. What's up, <laughs> What's up, dog? Franklin, There's yeah, got to be a YouTube the video out there where somebody the has month. taken all the cutscenes of this game and, like, narrowed it down to every single time they say the n words and count it off. There has to be a video out there that does that. It's like that one video where somebody took all the episodes of Johnny Test and shown you all the whip cracks. You know what I'm talking about? I take no prisoners. I go hard doing this shit. Big dog, big nuts. When names is on the motherfucking board, I want to see... It did that a week after the game came out. <laughs> wow, that quick. Fuck next month, Simeon. What about today? I, I demand a retrial. Today is nothing. Just a bike. Hasn't made a payment at all. Some kid at Vespucci Beach. His name is Esteban Jimenez. Is he in a gang? Curiously enough, I did not inquire when he bought the bike. <laughs> We got work to do, uh, employee of the month. Man, fuck you and come on. Man, you was about a yes master ass nigga. Wasn't there a video of someone gasping during, like, a Call of Duty montage? I don't know what that is. What, you mean, like, a compilation of somebody, like, like, gasping, like, is there, like, speaking between sentences or something? How about you drive? I don't know if I've seen that. that. I feel like I might have, but I'm not entirely sure. With the tattoo on his face and shit. Yeah. One thing I love about this game is like when you're driving from one place to another, they've not only recorded all the dialogue to account for most of your journey, but you can interrupt that dialogue at any point by crashing into things. And the the brilliant thing about this is when you interrupt like the dialogue. They'll like respond to it like you'll say for example you crash into a car and like like the guy will respond by being like hey watch where you're going or something and then like a moment after that they will immediately pick up from the sentence where they left off it's fantastic I love that that was him fuck homie I don't want motherfucker I don't want no unnecessary bullshit here, yeah you see what I mean I love that that's so good it's a reason you never see games do that oh I'm going the wrong way. In your case, I ain't so sure about that. Man, step up, nigga. Of course this dude real. Who else gonna have to require a surplus of paper and deficiency of brain cells? I was he thinking of getting, like, an RTX shader mod for this game, but it was too much of a hassle to get, like, figured out. Man, this whole setup designed to take drug money. Like, there's a paywall to get the RTX shader mod, but on top of that, you need a Patreon account, and I don't really have one, nor do I want one. So, at that point, I was like, yeah, never mind. Like, I don't mind paying for it, it's just I don't want to make a Patreon account, that's the thing where I draw the line at. Plenty of other shaders for this game. If anybody knows of any good ones, feel free to send me a DM with that. Maybe I'll try it next time. I'm just playing the pure vanilla version right now, but I could always, you know, set something up for the next time I play this game. All my graphic settings are set to maximum, of course. But, again, just vanilla shaders. Oh, right. I thought I had to walk to that. I need to park the car there. Nah, you ain't sitting this one out, homie. The bike should be in one of the lockups down here. Should be is the story of your life, asshole. I'm gonna make this look easy. You so, see? This body tattoo? Yeah, use body tattoo? 
What's up, homie? You all right? No way, way, away from me! We're for example, agents! Uh, yeah, you thought I was gonna hit your bitch ass, huh? Drunk ass nigga. Yeah, take that. Cool, nigga. Yeah, that's right. Keep it moving, bitch. Man, I don't like this shit one bit. Again, I've never played San Andreas, but I have played Grand Theft Auto 3 hey, and Vice City. Smooth, Both huh? of those games are pretty good. Pussy, the only thing that's smooth up in this shit. Man, what exactly did I do in a past life to deserve your stupid ass? This is a routine lick, dog. Chill. Do them Vagos look routine? This is shady ass alley. Shit, we in Vespucci Beach. We on the wrong side of Vespucci Beach. You should know a block makes a difference. Hey, 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 hold up. You got to be in one of these motherfuckers. Alright, search the garages, or garages as we call them here in the UK. I know that's a way, weird way of putting it, but a, a weird way of putting it, rather. I don't know what the fuck I just picked up there, but I picked up something. Hang on a minute. Hey, hey, hey. Let's do this. One sec. Oh. I'm just checking. One minute, one minute. What button is it? Just looking at the controls real quick because I don't remember how you switch items. I don't. Yeah, I don't, I don't see it. <laughs> which one is it to switch weapons again? Because I don't know what I just picked up there and I want to look at it to see what it was. Assuming it's a weapon, of course. Like, it could have been anything. Unless I'm not ready to do that right now. Fuck it. I'll worry about that later. I'm sure the game will tell me how to do it. No motherfucking bike in here, man. No shit, nigga. Hola, amigos. L1. Uh, right, so that should be LB here, then man. on the yeah. Xbox. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Hello, hello. Vamos. Fuck, fucking die here. Come on down, everybody. Come on down. Hey, nigga, I would've just got my ass beat over a fucking gunfight. Man, stop being a pussy, nigga. Okay, now I've got a weapon. Holy shit, that car was loud. I've got my windows open right now because it's been warm lately. And that car that just passed by right now was super loud. I'm not sure if my microphone picked that up. It probably did. Here's the thing about this area. It's a nice quiet area where my apartment is, but there's always like some really obnoxiously loud vehicles going by, which I don't understand why people... Oh, shit. Leave it up to me to die there as well. Right, okay then, so, yeah, it should, you know what I'm trying to say. I'm, I'm not even going to, like, trip on my words anymore. You you get what I'm trying to talk about. I forgot which button it was to go into cover mode. Was that... Yeah, this is the cover button. Oh. Pump shotgun. Up there to the right. Up there, shoot that nigga. Bust his ass. Some more of them niggas. Get that car, homie. Damn. Light them niggas up. The fuck? Oh, I died. For a minute there, it didn't look like I died, but then I realised I was going, I was falling backwards. Default difficulty, by the way. Like, it's not even that hard. I'm just really, really bad at video games. You might even say DSP levels are bad in areas. I see what you mean about auto-aim being kind of semi-important for this sort of game. It 
if you're using a controller. Ah! Didn't think to do that before. I mean, it's kind of obvious in hindsight. I just didn't think about that the first time. Oh. Four shots usually takes care of them. Oh yeah, don't you spam the A button to like run faster? Well get this shit done. Man, this is fucking crazy. I forgot if this was the game to do it, but in this game, if this is the one I'm thinking of, there's like a stamina regen system where you have a very short stamina for running, but the more you run, the longer your stamina gets over the course of the game. Is that this game that does that, or am I thinking of a different game? So you're pretty much encouraged to like run all the time so you can run further and further. Right, let's see, which button was the hand handbrake? It is the RB button. That's the last button I would have fucking guessed for handbrake. See, I was pressing like A, B, X, Y, it's none of those buttons. Oh shit. Yeah, maybe not use that for those kind of turns. Yeah, I kind of fucked that one up. Mainly because I was just testing the driving handbrake thing. At least the game has the courtesy to checkpoint you back here, right? So no more dicking around, let's do this. Let's get him, homie. I want to get paid. Paid ain't worth shit when you're doing 25 with an L. We massacred those motherfuckers. Shit. Yeah, I'm also just going to stick to normal braking for now. This, this isn't the best time for hand braking. And whose fault is that, Mr. 80s action movie body count motherfucker? Don't play the blame game. Just get on this shit. Motherfuckers getting away from him. That's because he's sitting on 140 cubic inches right there, nigga. Pop that fool. We need him on his ass so we can get what we came for. Man, you lost him already. That's a monster fucking bike you riding, stupid. Nah, we got this. Oh, fuck. Shoot him down. Come. Take the bike and meet me at the car wash round the way. All right, drive safe. Nice. The damn public. This is public radio, right? If I set you up, you got you gotta hit the ball. If I underhand it to you, you gotta hit the ball. See, like hitting into walls and shit. With the bike, I can understand because one, well, it's a bike, and two, it's way smaller, so it's more forgiving because your hitbox isn't as fucking massive, like trying to drive through like roads quickly. <coughs> Sorry, clear my throat there. Um, so if you're doing that with a car, it's much worse. Like in Grand Theft Auto, like tapping any wall at like a decent speed, not even like maximum speed, but just like anything above like. 50 miles per second hour, sorry, will just fucking send you flying. And that, more than anything, was like one of the biggest turn offs for me with the, with the last game. I'm not sure if I'm alone in this, maybe a lot of people like that, but for me personally, it really wasn't a good design choice. I felt like it was realism for the sake of realism and not like good game design. Okay, I gotta go through 
Like, because sometimes with game design, you've got to have a compromise where it's like, should we do, should we be true to life or should we make it, you know, more fair for the player? Oh, so what the fuck is going on with this voice, voice thing right now, the radio? You done finally fucking lost it. Nigga, that's that Apache blood in me, homie. You ain't lucky I ain't do a flying tomahawk or scalp they motherfucker. I'm gonna take a drink of water while this is playing. Because I, my, my throat's uh, got a bit of a frog in it. And we ain't going to neither, nigga. I'm gonna keep this motherfucker for myself. Tell Simeon we couldn't recover. You fucking tell him, you fucking moron! All right. Headshots one out of six. So there's like completion bonuses and stuff. Strangers and freaks can be found throughout San Andreas? Question mark. Oh yeah, this game takes place in San Andreas as well, doesn't it? Because I know in Grand Theft Auto 4, it was like, back to Liberty City, which was the place in Grand Theft Auto 3. Let me see this person, because it might be interesting. There's some good side quests and shit, you've just got to look for them. Thankfully there's somebody pretty close by. I think that's his sister. And what about you? I mean, you know, I quit. You know what I'm saying? Almost. Yeah, whatever. JB, look, JB gonna lose I'm not sure if that's his sister. Lose. It's somebody you know or uh, it's a person. His cousin, nigga, you said you was gonna he help. Ain't my cousin. Whatever, if that's how you feel. What the fuck do I know about touring cars? Look, it's easy. If JB can do it, you can do it for fuck's sake. Come on, I'ma show you. Come on, shit. Alright then. Shit. Showing everything. Hey, look, let's make this quick. I got shit to do. Nigga, you need to slow it down. Tanisha was right. I need a car. I will take this one. Oh, oh, oh. Where are your wheels at? Bitch, we'll take these Get wheels. I thought she was making bank. That's what I'm talking about. You doing it old school. Hey, Alright, shit, where we going? Trucks at the Davis Sheriff impound. Oh man, how did I get dragged into this? We both know you always been sweet on me. <laughs> shit, Franklin Clinton. Shit, your ass must be high or something. I told you, I don't do that shit, Franklin. I don't do that shit no more. I mean, I'm baby. I love how they just pick up just exactly where they left off. That's such a good, good thing. Such a good feature. Whatever you say, girl. Come on. Um. Oh. <laughs> Bear with me, I keep pressing the wrong buttons. I thought I could, like, jump over the fence because I'm trying to get to the waypoint. But I have to go around this way, I think. Let's go bring the cha-ching, homie. Also, I keep forgetting which button is run. Like, because I just keep punching the air, thinking that's the run button. Oh, 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 oh. Yeah, I'm going to have to get into the habit of remembering to switch that as soon as I get in the car or the truck. I may have to edit the VOD for this to remove some of that stuff. Like, it's not just a Twitch thing, it's also a YouTube thing, because YouTube can also be aggressive when it comes to detecting, like, copywritten music. When we eventually do get a Grand Theft Auto 6, I'm pretty sure streamer mode is going to be one of the core features in it. Like, it has to be, right? I mean, the remaster of Burnout Paradise has one, so, yeah. Move that seat back, and you know I'll make it right for you. That ain't what I'm saying. 
Damn, Tanya. What the fuck happened to you? And your woman sees you all covered in animal entrails, or even swallowing the neighbor's liver, she's gonna think twice about hassling you. Twice. Just making sure I'm on the right station. Oh jeez. Okay, I've seen JB do this a hundred times. Back up close. Make sure the hook is down. And it should slide right in. The lowest creature in nature becomes your great ally. Hey, baby. Back it up nice and steady. I compost condoms. I compost people. I compost every damn thing I can. And my flowers grow. My flowers grow from that compost. My garden is rich. My garden uh, is rich. My heart is full. Cheryl, you okay? You look hungover. Oh, you all right? right, there we go. I'm just mesmerized by these fish. What are they doing? They're swimming in the trash. Okay, there we, we go. are in, baby. Let's get this back to the lot. Hey, this was not how I saw my day going. Yeah, there was a bit of a delay there between when you hold the, the left analog stick direction and when the crane moves up and down. So I wasn't entirely sure if that was even working there. You have to hold it down for a bit and then it starts moving. Can't stay in Chamberlain Hills forever. Oh, nigga got airs now. I remember you before you was a wannabe when you just was. And I remember you and JB before y'all was dope here. Shit changes. You the one all turfed up. JB smoking, but he ain't smoking homies. He out here grinding, towing cars, paying bills. For real? Because I could have sworn it was me out here towing cars for him. And looking damn fine doing it too, baby. My mind's going other places right now. Hold on now. You get me upset. Now. Okay, we make the drop where they got the areas marked. They get real finicky when we don't leave it in the right place. Oh, that's much better. Much better. Who's on the phone? Line six. I mean, this one is really busy. Okay, you got it. Release that baby. Um. How? Uh oh. What did I say, woman? About how we're calorie hoarders. About how there are starving people and where. Tell you up there how to do that. I'll see you on the block. Anything you need, you holler at me. You called for mandatory gastro vans for all large Americans. Like now, where is that fool? All right. Mission time didn't quite make the quota there, but okay. Well, I got a new contact from my phone. Press A to duck well in the vehicle. Okay. Weird thing for the game to tell me right now, but alright. The most important thing to know in the game, duck in a vehicle. New text message. Oh! Yeah, how about you not do that? Let me take that car, please. I'll check that text in a moment. I'm just going to get away from that guy so they don't, like, steal my car back. Alright, that should be far enough. Right, text messages from Lamar. Stretch is going out, homie. Stretch has... Stretch. 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 I don't know what that is. His bed's almost done. We go and haul at you, dog. Haul at, we're gonna haul it at you, dog. Ray, we have talked about this. I'm not into you. I'm by, but this is so inappropriate. This your boy LD. Long dick. Holla at me. My heart. I'll tell you what. Touch my heart. Place your hand on my central solar plexus. Emails. Let me breathe deep. Me, not us. Uh, I'm not gonna read all this. Like, I'm gonna read it, but I'm not gonna like physically read it out loud. I'm just gonna read it to myself. Just emptied a bunch of butts out into regular gum and rolled it up, and that's what I'm chewing. You an addict, girl? You is an addict. I'm just skimming, really. Next, Cola. Hi, Doctor Ray. Okay. There's a bunch of stuff you can do with your phone.
actually. Shit. I was gonna take that car instead. That one seemed fast. Yeah, proceeds to steal the tow truck after I just towed in a vehicle with it. I mean, it's not like I got my keys revoked. I can use it any time. But yeah, one of the things I loved about Grand Theft Auto 3 growing up was the radio stations because there was just like hours of content that you could just like really enjoy. Well, there was a really funny radio station. I forgot what it was called. Chatterbox or something like that. Damn. Thanks again, Internet. What? That crazy motherfucker Lamar hasn't got you killed yet? No, not yet. He must be slacking. He's always slacking. He's a fool, bro. Yes, sometimes. Anyway, talking of fools, what would you say if I told you some fools I knew were running a little racing competition? Oh, it's and this thing, right? Habit, they got this really beautiful silver medal with your name on it. I say go fuck yourself. Bronze medal then? <laughs> I'm funny, motherfucker. Yeah, you can do car races in this game. Uh, I need a good one. Let's see if I can find something better. Does this game have licensed cars? Not that I'm a, a car person, but you know. I've been wondering because Fortnite recently added Ferraris into the game, and it's like, what? No. I know there's a mod that adds, like, product placements into the game, like McDonald's and shit. I think it's called Grand Theft Auto V Real Life or something like that. I was thinking about installing that, but I don't know where to find the, the download for it. I need to look around for that one. I don't know if this is the best. Yeah, I don't know if this is the best car for this. It might not be. Yeah, this is good racing music. Listening to people ramble at each other. <laughs> Next time I stream this, I'm going to have video game music or whatever set up, so that we at least have something in So that we at least have something to listen to besides like this. I mean, this is a fun thing to listen to as well, but this is not racing music. Right, well, I've already, lo <laughs> I've already lost the race. Oh. Yeah, this may be a good time to use my handbrake. Welcome to Forza Horizon 5. At the very least, I would like to catch up to the, the next person up, but I don't think I'm going to win this race. Oh, that's a very solid lamppost. Or phone line. Right, well that's the second lap and I'm, I'm still in last, ugh, I am still in last place. Yeah, if you click both analog sticks it activates your slowdown thing. Which I guess makes it easier to turn here. Yeah, it actually does. Interesting. I'm holding the controller in a weird way right now. Like both my middle finger and index finger are resting on the RT and RB buttons. Because that's what you need for handbraking and like acceleration. I'm not sure if I can rebind that. I don't think I'm gonna win this by a long shot. Fuck me. Yeah, no amount of special can bring you back from that. Oh, 
What do you get if you win? Is it just money? I'm assuming I can re-challenge this race at any time if I if I want to. Oh, I thought I could break through that. I like how they still play that like sound effect as to imply that you died, even though you didn't die, you just lost the race. Okay, I can retry it. Right, maximum effort this time, let's go. Oh jeez. Ah, oh, no. I like how the game checkpointed the radio station as well. Whenever I realise that copyright music is playing, I get on edge really fucking fast. Oh jeez. Those telephone lines can be a bitch. Like, you think you can break them down, but nope. They stay standing and you stay still. Okay, there we go. Spin. I'm still in fourth place, so I'm, I'm already I'm already doing better than my last attempt. Oh Jesus! Fuck me. No, that didn't that didn't go too well, did it? One thing I love about Grand Theft Auto 3, and they kind of like expand on that in this game, is the commercials for the radio stations. There's a lot of really funny skits in the form of like the commercials. Like, because I remember in Grand Theft Auto 3, there was this running gag with like several commercials that they did throughout the radio stations for a reality TV show called Liberty City Survivor, which was basically like a real life battle royale, like just everybody running out to like kill each other on the streets. Another thing I loved about the radio stations on Grand Theft Auto 3 was like a lot of the commercials gave you website addresses and when you went to those website addresses it was like fake websites for the products in question and all the websites were like made by Rockstar themselves. Like, that shit was fantastic. I, I, I love that stuff. I don't know if that, those websites still exist. Oh. I'm back in sixth place again. Right, so I'm not going to win this time, but I think next time... Oh my god, really? Right, well, since I'm gonna lose anyway, might as well just do what the fuck ever. Yeah, there was a... What what the fuck was it? There was a commercial in Grand Theft Auto 3. It was... I'm trying to remember the name of it. Like, the, the whole joke was, oh, you... You're tired of going to a pet store to get pets, you can rent pets online or something like that. And I forgot the name of the product in question, but there was like a real website for that that they made specifically and the the website address was in that commercial in the radio station. So it wasn't exactly like ARG or anything, but it was like kinda cool that they went that far with like the details. Let's see, GTA GTA 3, if I can type GTA 3. Radio commercial. It's Pets Overnight. Well, let's see. Pets Overnight website. Petsovernight.com. Hang on. I don't know if this website still exists. Oh, that's lame. Okay, so all it does is redirect you to the official Grand Theft Auto 3 landing page. It doesn't actually exist anymore. That's a shame. In fact, you know what I could do? 
Um, my internet's dying, by the way, because that's what happens when I try loading up websites while streaming. So, if the stream starts to buffer, that's the reason. I can't do anything about that. I've got an idea. Let's see, pets. Right, okay, I've got an idea. Where, where is the name of this place again? Wayback? Wayback Machine? Hopefully Wayback Machine has this archived. Right, petsovernight.com. Like, I'm fully committed to this now. I want to see. It's been archived as far back as 2001, so I think back then it would have existed. Oh my god, it exists. <laughs> it's real. Well, it was real at some point. I don't know if this is the proper, like, it's not, I, th I don't think it's displaying correctly because it hasn't been properly archived because the page looks broken as fuck. Let me look for a different, like, archival of this. I'll try 2002. November 2002. Maybe this one will actually display correctly. Nah, I think it's just because the website's old as fuck that it doesn't uh, display correctly, but close enough. Let me see if I can see I, I, for some reason my dark mode uh, extension is not kicking in so it doesn't look right. right I'm going to do the next best thing. I'm going to highlight the text that's like kind of hard to read. I'm going to take a screenshot and I'm going to show you guys what this looks like. Sorry for like interrupting the game for this. Like I really wanted to see if this was real like, or if it like I mean, it, obviously it was real, but words, I, I, the words fail me right now. Like, I was just trying to prove that it did exist and if it was, like, archived. And yeah, it was archived. Where is my... Oh, that's right. I need to... My share X folder is not what it usually is. Let me just go get that real quick. Screenshots. Sort by most recent. Right, here we go. So, the website's kind of broken, but here's what it looks like from Wayback Machine. Petsovernight.com, delivering little bundles of love in a box directly to your door. Forget about the flowers, send a real-life present that shows how much you love someone. Everyone loves kittens. A grieving widow can be consoled by a new puppy in her life. For the man who has everything, how about a white rhino for a living room? Or a miniature pit pickanese fighting... <laughs> Fighting bitch? <laughs> what? If it's got a central nervous system, we've got it ready to go in a box to your house. And then any pet anywhere overnight. Kittens, puppies, fish, rhinos, stomach parasites, vermin, whales. How the fuck can you fit a whale into your house? Fighting bitch. <laughs> What's a fighting bitch? What, dogs? Sharks and mackerel. <laughs> oh, fucking hell. So yeah, there was like a number of websites. In fact, I think Liberty City, Liberty City Survivor was also a website. Let's see, Liberty City Survivor. Let's see, does this show up in Google? We'll get back to the game in a second. I'm just too caught up in this right now because I wanted to remember that this shit existed at some point. Where was the website? Hang on. Anyone know what the website address for Liberty City Survivor was? Assuming there was a website attached to it. Because I don't remember. I can't seem to find it. In fact, you know what I'm going to do? Uh, Grand Theft Auto 3 Commercial Websites. Actually, hang on. Radio commercial websites. Nah, I can't find... Don't you love it when you're trying to find information quickly and you, you can't, for the love of you, like, find it? But whatever, you, you get the idea. Um, Petsovernight.com was a pretty good one. Right, let's, let's do this again. 
let me just uh, bring the game back up. The game's been running in the background, but I had to like check my browser. I really need to get my second monitor plugged in at some point so that I can, you know, do this shit more easily without things causing issues. Um, I'm sorry, what? Why is my controller not working? Hang on. Fuck. I... Okay, I'm unplugging my controller right now because it's not being picked up for some reason. Okay, now it is. Can I restart that? Is there a way to load up the the quick the 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 check the, the checkpoints like the the nearest checkpoint? I guess I'll attempt it for now. Whoa! What the fuck? Okay, so that AI fucked up. I'm assuming there's a bit of rubber banding going on. I am so bad at this. See, if this was Grand Theft Auto, I would have flung- I would have fallen out of the car, like, 20 times. I would assume that GTA 4 has a mod that removes that, we'll just say, feature. Which of those, like, I've got a question for you guys, which of those bars at the bottom below the map is my special? Because I don't know if it's the blue or the yellow one, because I'm trying to conserve it and not waste it too much. It's the yellow one, I see the, the flashing. Green one's your health bar, I don't know what the blue one stands for though. Nice. Fuck. Alright, we're good. Right, well, I'm doing better this time. I'm in third place, coming up second. Oh! Spoke too soon. Shit. Shit. Oh, by the way, we are less than a month away now from No More Heroes 3. I can't wait for that game. I really hope No More Heroes 3 is good. Like, when that game comes out and I stream it, there is a chance I may be very critical of the game because I have, uh, let's just say, high expectations for it after the second game. Because after that shit that was Travis Strikes Again, I think we need, like, a home run with this next game. Oh shit, I'm in first, I didn't realise. Oops, wrong one. I was about to, I was prepping a turn there and I realised, oh wait, it's not that one that you turn at, it's the next one. I think I'm good. Yeah, I think that's... I think that's it. Also, was the copy? God damn it! I completely forgot to change the radio station again. Oh Jesus! If you go fast enough, it will happen, but you have to go really fast for that to actually happen. In Grand Theft Auto 4, it's very easy to get knocked out of the car at like medium to slow speeds, which was what annoyed the fuck out of me. But yeah, talk about ending the race with a fucking bang, just like flying out of my car. And yet I still survive. Like, look at my health bar. I almost died from that. I'm assuming, I don't know if I'll get to him tonight, but I'm assuming it's not too far into the game before we start to see Michael's story. Because at the start of the game, you, you can only get access to Franklin. Trevor doesn't come until quite a bit into the game, so we won't see him tonight, sadly. But yeah, Trevor is like the best part of this game, easily. 
might be the next mission. Oh yeah, so certain missions have to take place at certain times of day, so when you see this, that means it's just advancing to the right time. But you know what? It's getting to be a bit much. I have no idea how you cope. Of course I cope. I'm a woman. <laughs> Ain't that the truth? <laughs> <laughs> but girl, I done done all that I can do. But you know how boys are. Wait a minute. Oh girl. Whew. Hey, how much further? We ain't even gone five yards yet. Okay. I know. I'm just asking. This is spirit walking. Exercises body and soul. It's all the rage. We are women we and are we women. are free. Bring it in. We are women. We are free. We are women. We are shouting. We are women. Damn. All right. F, is that your auntie? Yeah, thank God I missed her crazy ass. I fruit at all oh, shit, I remember that. Just her attempts to I, I don't be talking There's like a really good mission I mean, later in the game well. involving I fruit, which is Come this in. game's like we gotta go pick up some shit parody of here, Apple. Walk and talk at the same time, my nigga. Why the fuck we can't drive? Around the block. Apple iPhones shot? or whatever. You need to walk with your fat ass. <laughs> yeah, okay, you tall linky son of a bitch. Also, oh, doggo. We ain't got all day. Let's go. For sure, but what you got up? Kidnapping fool, that clown D, that OG fool from Baller. Dog, I told you, no more game banging retro vengeance bullshit. I'm trying to make some fucking paper. You gonna make some paper? Yeah, I don't have no, access to Michael out right out now. Gang it just look like that. You gotta know the difference, man. Fuck, man, great. My aunt would be very happy, homie. She wants me dead anyway, so she can get the fucking house. You got the wheel, homie. All right. Get in the van, Chop. Get in the van. Good dog. We going to Vinewood Boulevard. Oh, right. Sorry, that's something I keep forgetting. Like, within the first couple seconds, it doesn't hit me yet that there's, like, copyright music being played. Next time I play this, that will not be an issue. Hey, why we doing this, dog? Man, cuz, we supplementing our income. More like supplementing the drama in our lives. Is that fool Simeon looking out for us, or is he looking out for himself? Shit, himself, I guess. So how I God, this game is so nice looking. Like us get ahead. By getting serious. Exactly. Like this came, this game came out pretty much at the very end of the Xbox 360 and PlayStation 3's life. This pushed that hardware really hard. And yeah, obviously it didn't run at 60 frames per second on those systems, but it was still a very nice looking game, all things considered. They don't go right, but I wouldn't say that they go wrong all the time neither. Not as wrong as they could. I ain't dead, but I ain't rich neither. How does 40,000 sound? Cause that's what's happening right here. Man, I believe it when I'm holding. Three-way split, homie. Me, you, and Chop. Man, Chop don't. Nope. Chop don't get shit. Chop an intern. I like that they not only pick up from where they leave off, but they pretty much pick up from the exact word in the sentence. Like they don't start the full sentence again. They just like pick up from the important bit, which you know is like little details like that. I appreciate a lot in video games. You hear that, Chop? We don't really see that in any other game outside of this. I don't know if Grand Theft Auto 4 did it, but this game does it. I'm assuming Red Dead Redemption 2 does it. I don't know about the first one because I've never played it. What's up, boo? Ain't you little Laida's cousin? Yeah. Damn, you short witty. I was just saying. I'm hoping you guys are enjoying watching me play this because I know this is not the kind of game I usually stream. But this is a game that I, I find a lot of fun in. Shit, how about I put one of these little X pills up your ass crack? Next thing you know, you're gonna be begging for it, boo boo. What's happening now, D man? Ain't no fun if the gangsters can't have none. Man, fuck you, Mark. I ain't sharing no ass to CGS. Ain't nobody sharing nothing. Man, shut the hell up, fuck bitch. Fuck you, nigga. Man, fuck y'all. Hey, ain't there a law against you, Mark ass, gangsters, insignia, mass wearing motherfucker? Oh, so what's up now, nigga? You snitching or something, oh, nigga? Oh, shit. Bitch ass nigga. I'm gonna have to watch that. I'm gonna have to find and watch that video compilation of all the times they've said the N-words. Right. 
You see what he driving? Man, we in a van, motherfucker. We fuck. Just drive, fool. Should they rent a fighting bitch? You should get two of them. That way they can fight each other. I mean, who are you gonna like? Who's it gonna fight you? You don't want that, do you? Oh. Oh. We heavier, use that momentum and shit. I don't know what you're contributing right now, fool. We might have to rethink this 60 40 split. Me? You and. Ain't doing shit. Chop is doing more to get this nigga. than you. And he just drew. Oh, jeez. Didn't see that car because I was looking at the bike in front. Oh! We're chasing another motherfucker on a motorcycle. If we Shit. This dude, his ass right. I think there's a little bit of rubber banding because I feel like that bike should have gone a lot further than that. Chinatown, I think. Jesus. <laughs> Scripted, but... I was not expecting Man, that. Hey, Chop, go get that fool. Now you just sitting your ass there with your feet kicked up. Come on, Chop. Come on. Go bite his ass. Get I'm not sure if that's Chinatown per se, but that's yeah. like some sort of marketplace. I also need to get into the habit of sprinting in this game because, again, if this is the game I think it is, I think the more you sprint, the longer your stamina gets over time. Like your maximum stamina. At the start of the game, I'm lacking the stamina. This kind of reminds me of, uh... Fuck, what's that game called? Sleeping Dogs? We are just doing, like, parkour shit, chasing people. Sleeping Dogs is another really good open-world game. I have considered streaming that. But ultimately, this is the game I'm choosing to stream. In terms of, like, filling the open-world gap. I very rarely stream open world games. I usually stream something more condensed and experience. It's kind of like a JRPG. It's like a big commitment, but in this kind of game, I think I'm better at committing to this sort of thing. At least I think so. Oh. Hang on. Yep, you can play as Doggo in this game. Are you playing as a fighting bitch? Isn't a bitch supposed to be a female dog? I'm pretty sure this dog is not female. about this. Yep. Come on, chop. Get off here, man. We got shit to nice. Do. Or not nice, depending on your perspective, but... Get out that thing, chop, you filthy motherfucker. So I don't know about petting the dog in this game, but dogs can fuck each other. Respect for your enthusiasm, home. Come on, chop. Get off there, man. We got shit to do. Do I have to, like, stand next to him and- okay. Okay, now I can sprint. Well, I can sprint back to there. Yep, they're here. I can see the trail. 
You in here? You scared of dogs, nigga? Oh, shit! Screw that dog, man! Don't hump him! Bite his ass, chop! <laughs> Right, well, if Pixel d doubted that this dog was a female, that definitely, you know, verified that it is in fact a male dog. It's not a fighting bitch. God, they, they've said that word so many times in like the first couple hours of this game. If you don't train Chop, he gonna be a lost cause like you, dog. We gonna stash this dude in my spot. We going back to your crib? I've been there when you was in diapers. Shut up, man. I love how the dog is continuing to antagonize this guy in the fucking back seat. You always been dumb, Lamar. Really? Well, I guess that means we gonna have to shoot your ass when we pick up our 40 stacks. You ain't gonna pick up shit. Fans gonna be on you before you can even move, nigga. Be quiet, I gotta make a call. So I haven't finished migrating everything to my new Windows 10 installation, but pretty much got most of the necessities in place, which is good. I'm gonna be working more on the migrating process later tonight after I'm done streaming. But everything I need for streaming purposes is pretty much there. Also, I keep forgetting about the music, sorry about that. If I have to, I'll, I will mute. Ugh. If I have to, I will mute the the VOD before I upload it to YouTube. I may have to delete the Twitch VOD as a result of this. Again, because Twitch can be very aggressive. Like, Twitch can potentially destroy your account. Like, they'll just terminate your account if they detect too much licensing music. That's what concerns me. It's like a new, relatively new policy they put in place. I'm a motherfucking gangster, you know how I do. I can take care of my sizzle. But again, when part two of this comes around, that will not be an issue. I will have music that will do for this. Right, okay then, well that was fun. Advanced reflexes. I don't know what that pertains to, but okay. I think this is the commercial playing right now. I'm gonna check something real quick actually. Um, this might potentially kill my internet, but I'm kinda curious about something. Right, okay, so there is a there is a YouTube video that contains every single radio commercial from Grand Theft Auto 3. There's one for Pets Overnight as a standalone video, I guess I'll do that one. Let me just, uh, I'm going to load the video up, but I'm going to quickly change the quality down to the lowest possible so my internet doesn't die, because I don't want to load at 720p. Right, so this is a, a 15, I, th I think there's actually some, is there more than one of these? I think there's like multiple of them. Right, hang on a second. Right. No, that's not it. Bear with me, just looking for the, the specific commercial in mind. I'm really bad at doing this stuff on the fly. Unmute. Nope. Let's mute that tab again. 
Oh, okay, I found something. Pitsovernight.com uh, Actually, no, this is... See, this video that sh has all the commercials, it's over 10 minutes long, and they give you a list of all the commercials in the description, but they don't timestamp it, so that's going to cause a bit of an issue trying to specifically find these. You might hear some sounds. A feudal surf. Forget about size. Do we a giraffe? Have one delivered. Right, here we go. Right, sorry, I had, I had to find the commercial. So here is the PetsOvernight.com commercial from Grand Theft Auto 3. For those wondering what the fuck I was talking about. Would you like a giraffe? Have one delivered. Just log on to PetsOvernight.com and we'll send you a giraffe overnight. PetsOvernight.com, delivering little bundles of love in a box directly to your door. Yeah, there's like multiple of these commercials. Let's see if I can find the next one. And left. Delivering. And we'll send. Fiverr. Natural selection has come home. Would you like a kitten? Have one delivered. Just log on to petsovernight.com and we'll send you a cute kitten overnight. Petsovernight.com. Delivering little bundles of love in a box directly to your door. <laughs> Right, okay, and the last one is a little bit further along. Commercial number 13. Are you bored with Here man's is. best friend? Sorry, Fido, we're gonna have to drown you. <laughs> Why not try oh my God. first cousin? At PetsOvernight.com, we've got every primate in stock, from spider monkeys to gorillas. You'll love your new best friend. Mommy, Jim Jim bit me. Oh yeah, then you just buy them back then, okay, honey? PetsOvernight.com, delivering little bundles of love in a box directly to your door. So yeah, that, that's all three commercials. Like They play them like throughout the radio stations in Grand Theft Auto 3, and that was like one of the most memorable ones. Other commercials include... House of Tomorrow, Liberty City Survivor, there's two of those. Uh, Fernando's New Beginnings, I remember that one. Equinox. Sue Anyone, in fact, let, let me get the Sue Anyone up, this one sounds fun. It sounds exactly what it sounds like. This is new. Hang on a second. From Zybatsu Pharmaceuticals. Ask your doctor. Life's harsh reality. Is your job affecting your health? Right, so this is, I think this is the Sue Anyone. It's, it's literally called Sue Anyone. S-U-E, Anyone. You become fatigued? Does working take time away from family and social events like watching wrestling? There's an easy solution. Sue your boss. See, the great thing about this country is you can sue anyone for pretty much anything. And you'll probably win, or at least get a settlement. At the firm of Rakin and Ponzer Personal Injury Attorneys, we can show you how falling down and howling like a sissy can result in a large damage award from your employer. We also specialize in awards for injuries suffered in auto, bus, and train accidents, and can even train you to throw yourself in front of a bus and pretend to be injured. Hey, that's why they pay for insurance. Call the law offices of Rakin and Ponzer and get ready to enjoy a life of luxury. Has your marriage gone s Yeah, that was the Sue Anyone commercial. <laughs> you can pretty much sue anyone in this country. Mel, can I sue you for being too pink? Yeah, it's a free country. Go for it. I can sue you for owning one fighting bitch and not two of them. Like, if you don't own two fighting bitches, you're not doing it right. Right, let's go back to Simon. And see what Simon says. Various events unfold across San Andre- Oh shit, there's something happening over there. I cannot do that. I lack the explosive technology to blow up the back of those doors. You can also destroy the truck by ramming into it, but that's way harder. So I am not even going to attempt that one. Now let's go see Simon. Where, where is he? He's over that way.
Sleeping Dogs is a really good game. It's like an open world game, but it's also... Like, it's kind of like a Grand Theft Auto clone, but it has the distinct difference of having, like, hand-to-hand -hand combat in it. It's kind of like Shenmue, but better. I say that as somebody who's a massive fan of the Shenmue series, but... It's kind of like Yakuza as well, now that I think about it. It's just like Yakuza slash Shenmue sort of game, but it's also like Grand Theft Auto. There's the jump button. Excuse me. That boy. I am his mentor. I am Hey Nico! What do you mean, a mentor? Don't worry about that. Okay, so what you got for him? Complications. Some kid. He is already late on his payments, and I have this bad feeling that he will do more damage to the car than we can get back from him in the exorbitant interest rate payments. Huh? Just go and get it. The house is on um Hampstead, uh, off Eclipse. It's an SUV. Yeah. Some Rockford Hills daddy's boy nonsense. Speaking of Yakuza, I really need to get back to Yakuza Zero because I streamed that a couple times last year and then I just completely dropped that game. Not really because of my own volition, it was just because it kind of started at a really bad time because I got really sick for a full month, like shortly after I started that game. And I haven't picked it up since. Really should get back to that. There's like several games I want to get back to. I'm starting some new games for now, like I'm st starting this, and technically Grand Theft uh, Minecraft is not going to be an ongoing thing, it's just going to be a one-off for today, but this will be a full playthrough. There's a new game coming out tomorrow that I want to stream, Blaster Master Zero 3, and then we've got No More Heroes 3 next month. So there's a good few games coming out as well as me playing this. Oof. Sucks to be him, I guess. Oh yeah, there's like a firearm shop, you can buy guns and stuff. Ammunition. I'm pretty sure that's the name of the gun company in Grand Theft Auto 3 as well. The company that deals in firearms. Let's see what we got. I think you can also buy explosives and stuff in here. Wait, that's not... Is that beer? It looks like beer boxes, but I'm not sure because I see guns on some of them. I guess, I guess it is beer. Yeah, we sell beer and guns. Those are a good combination. <laughs> now let's see. Oh yeah, you can buy uh, bullet vests as well. Oh yeah, hunting vests. See, I remember there being some missions where you can go deer hunting. I guess that's what those are for. Right, let's look at the good shit. So yeah, there's a lot of good guns here. Oh, I see we've got some hacking tools here. Nice. Bottle. It's not clever and it's not pretty, but most of the time, neither is the guy coming at you with a knife. When all else fails, this gets the job done. So you just stick it in their fucking face. Bro. But yeah, we got a knife, antique clavery dagger, uh, we got a baton, or a nightstick, hatchet, hammer. Yeah, there's a lot of good stuff in here. Of course, most of this stuff is locked, but I think as you progress through the game, more and more stuff becomes readily available. I've only got like a meager selection at the moment, most of it is greyed out. I want this, but of course that's not ready yet, so... Eventually, I will get access to a rocket launcher, but not right now. Wait, I can get this for free? Nanny? So, this stuff costs money, but the SMG is free? What's the catch? A high-capacity submachine gun that's both compact and lightweight holds up to 30 bullets in one magazine. Alright, well, if you're offering... I can tell we are gonna get along famous. Do I have to buy ammunition as well? Oh wait, there's more shit over here. We got tear gas, grenades. Uh, how much money do I have right now? Where is my money at? 
Oh, it's up there. Oh shit, I got a lot of money. Wait, how did how did Franklin get five hundred thousand dollars? What? Is that just something the game just gives you at the start? A jerry can, which is a can of gas. A, a can of gas. It's a ca a can of gas. I swapped the two letters. But yeah, um, I'm gonna buy some grenades. Yeah, let's get <laughs> let's get a whole bunch of them. Twenty. All right, thank you. Let's have some fun with our new toy. Did I just drop that? Yep. I don't remember how you throw shit. Oh, fuck. Oh, right, okay. That's how you throw it. There we go. That's the mayhem that I like in these games. Oh, shit. Oh my god. <laughs> Fuck. Should have gotten in that car just a little bit quicker. I think I accidentally dropped a grenade there when I was trying to get in the car. Uh, I forgot what button. It was this button. Right, I need to go back to ammunition to buy that shit again. I should have saved the game after doing that. Where is ammunition at? I'm in a mission now. Oh shit, you're right. <laughs> Fucking music. Yeah, sorry if I get a little irate with the music in this game. Again, blame Twitch and blame YouTube. More so Twitch, because they've been going much harder on this kind of shit. And I don't want my Twitch channel to dis disappear. Oh god, it's this again. Hey, did you change your mind? When I discover that you betray me, perhaps. I hear you took the bike for yourself, my employee of the month. Listen, man, me and Lamar was gonna get that back to you, dawg. Oh, I am sure. You will get this car off the daddy's boy, and then we talk. Insurance papers say they have a locked garage, so you'll need to gain access from inside the house. Man, it's never easy with you, is it, Simi? Do not talk to me about easy, you thief. Lamar the Backstabber. The greatest anime betrayal of all time. I think this is Michael's house. Oh. I believe there's like a stealth thing here where you've got to get in without the gardener like noticing. Uh, let me go this way actually. I think you can... Yeah, I think you can knock out the Gardener, but I don't know if I want to risk that because they might turn around by the time I get to them. Press LT plus B to knock them out. Eh, too late. I'm on my way to... Using stealth mode and performing takedowns will increase the stealth strat. Stealth stat, which allows for quicker and quieter movement. Do I want to do this? Yeah, we hit man now. 
that's another franchise that I need to check out at some point. I've never played a Hitman game. Oh. Is he just going to stay in that corner? Oh, fuck. Okay, I've, I've screwed this up already. See, I don't want to get too close in case he sees me. He does stay there. Right, okay. Hopefully he doesn't see me while I go around this then. See, I thought it was going to, like, turn around and start going in the other direction, but no, apparently he just stays there. So it was LT plus B, I think. I hope I remembered that. Bang. Bang, and the dot is gone. Can I take... Can I take this? No? Okay. Actually, I've got an idea. Might not be the best time to do it, but... <laughs> Why not? Oh, wait a minute. You have to face the other way, don't you? For that. Hang on. I got this. There we go. <laughs> uh, almost. I, I need to angle myself just right. Sorry for me being very, like, fiddly with this. Just, uh... Right, I think that's a good angle. Turn around. Right about there, I think. Oops. Shit. No. Delete. Fuck. <laughs> Sorry, I keep pressing the wrong button. Right, that's better. We get more of him in the shot. Right, so left stick for facial animations. Uh... Fuck. I, I, I screwed up. Oh, right, the left stick button. So I was, like, moving the stick around like an idiot. <laughs> I think this was, like, one of the very first video games to have a photo mode. And you guys know me, like, I love photo modes in video games. <laughs> That's a good face. Yeah, we'll go with that. Like he's got that smarmy face about him where he's like, Bitch, lunchtime is over, get back to work. Right, let's go inside and get that car. I think I remember how this mission plays out, because the, I think this is the mission that gets you access to Michael. Because right now, I believe this is Michael's home that we're invading, just to repo this car. Don't know if I can open the garage from there. I think I have to go inside. Nope. I love this, like, stealth music that's playing right now. Now we can open that from the front, I think. No? Okay. Guess there's a window then. Ah, there we go. Nope. What am I doing? I'll eventually find it. If I just keep walking around, I'll find a, a back entrance. Oh. <laughs> okay, you can kind of semi-sprint in stealth mode, which is useful. Oh, Jesus, camera. What are you doing? Climb into the... onto the... oh. I don't know if the game already told me that, because I may have not seen that earlier. 
That's just because you have a massive gaper, bitch. Fucking homo, you're dead. Dead! He said I had a massive... Jimmy called me a bitch! I guess they've got a fighting bitch in their house. Tried to knife attack me? I'll still rape you. I still playing Xbox battle. Live, no doubt. Sort of. <laughs> Thank you, Coach. You're a real pro, Mrs. DeSanta. A real pro. You know, you're a great student. Now just loosen up those hips. Okay, like this? Yeah, loosen them up. There you go. And follow through. Perfect. Uh oh, okay. I think I'm getting it. Need to wait for them to. Ooh, okay, Amanda. Right, now just follow through. Ah, you got great. Right. Hips. I wasn't sure if they were going to see me from there. Yes. Now. Slide your hips slow and sit into it right here. No, right here. Uh, Pretty interesting mission this early in the game. I could totally get used to this. Oh. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Me too. I guess the they they can't see me from there. Oh. <laughs> Help! He's black. To Holy shit! No one creeps on yeah, I wasn't entirely sure where to go there. Like I was trying to figure out where was the garage. I should be paying attention to the map. I was thinking, oh, do I have to like slowly go around them? But I guess that was the wrong way. Oh wait a minute! I see where they go. There's like a an extra, like see that small path in there. That's where you go. Let me just wait till they do their tennis exercises again before I go in again. Great student. Now just loosen up those hips. Okay, like this? Yeah, loosen them up. There you go. And follow through. Perfect. Shit. Fuck. Can I skip this? No. What an awful thing to say. Like, that's the first thing that goes through their minds. It's like, oh, never mind about the intruder himself, he's black. Loosen up those hips. Okay, like this? Yeah, loosen them up. There you go. And follow through. Perfect. Uh oh, okay. I think I'm getting it. Ooh, okay, Amanda. Right, now just follow through. Ah, you got great hips. You know that? <laughs> Shit! Fuck! I was trying to do the crouching sprint. I didn't realize I wasn't crouching, or at least I didn't think I was. I was trying to speedily sneak. Damn it. You can skip this part, but I don't want to do that. Right. I know exactly when to do it now. Sorry about that. Oh my god. You're a real pro, Mrs. DeSanta. A real pro. You know, you're a great student. Now just loosen up those hips. Okay, like this? 
Yeah, I caught that there. My brother is such a homo. I saw I did hear that. Okay. I think I'm getting it. Like, oh my god. Like she's that kind of person. There we go. Just had to find the ideal moment in which to sneak by. That's a nine millimeter semi automatic. Oh Before shit, there he is. Uh, look around. You just keep driving where you're going. Hey, come on, man. This was a repo job. Guy was behind on the fucking note. Unlikely. Considering my son just got the car. And looking at the way you're going about this, my guess, you're working a credit fraud. A credit fraud? Be serious, dude. I just worked the fucking repo. I appreciate a kid who follows orders without taking responsibility. Yeah, maybe one day we'll have a beer, and I'll explain how the world really works. Who gives you the slip? A car dealer, dog, by the name of Simeon Yateri. So this businessman, he look legit to you? Look, man, this is just between him and your fucking son. Don't worry. Me and Mr. Yetarian. We'll work this out. Oh, jeez. Trigger dip shit. Me and Mr. Yetarian. <laughs> we'll work this out. Wouldn't it be funny if you, like, dent the car and then the gun discharges and you just instantly die? Not sure if you guys heard that background noise there. Another loud vehicle passing by my apartment at like 1am in the morning. Gotta love that shit. Sometimes I just wonder what, who drives without a vehicle that loud at this time at night. Like, come on. Hey man, it's Jess up here. Okay, stop the car. Pull up. Oh. That the place? Yeah, this the place, man. Whoa. Drive into it. Right through the fucking window. And fast. Or I'll put two rounds in the back of your skull and do it myself. Man, you can't be for real. I look like a fucking joke to you. Man, fuck my life, man. Fuck you. Let's go! Damn, boy! What the fuck are you doing? Mr. Sammy, it's not exactly how it looks. I always trump big for a job well done. Now get out of here, kid. You motherfucker! I won't be treated like this! <laughs> that was not what I was expecting to happen there. <laughs> you think you could take me? Okay, it's A and B to attack. Just fucking jumped right into him. Come on, give me a hug. I'll get my lawyer. Simeon Yeterian doesn't back down from anybody. Fraudster pup. There we go. You recognize this car? Huh? Does it look like it's worth five grand a month to you? You fucking racist. Oh. I'll tell you something. This thing's gonna need some serious body work for it. it's worth five grand a month. <laughs> so yeah, doing more hand-to-hand -hand combat increases your stats and gives you more perks. They have some funk break into my fucking house. I I have done Hey kid might be a fucking idiot. So yeah, I think this is the game where sprinting increases your stamina overall. Like your overall stamina capacity. Don't make me have to come back here. Right, so I believe now we can finally play as Michael and start his side of the story, which I guess I could do for like the next 30 minutes or so. Yep, here we go. Again, Trevor we won't be getting to tonight. You don't see him for quite a while in this game. May not even get to him in part 2. So yeah, we can now switch between Michael and Franklin by holding down and switching on the menu. 
Right, okay then. Uh, let me go find a good car so we can do things. Get up, Michael. Michael! What's that? You want your bike back? Alright, you asked for it. Oh. That didn't exactly... Uh, that didn't exactly play the w out the way I was expecting it to. There we go. There you go. I mean, you careful what you wish for, I guess. I see some question marks nearby. I'm gonna go check them out before I return to my glorious mansion. So yeah, this dude is fucking loaded in terms of money, if that wasn't obvious already. Living the sweet life. And yet he's still living in hell or something, like he's basically living a lie. I'm gonna go way down here, I see like a question mark down there and I'm kinda curious as to what that one is. Also, there's a couple, like, fun side missions in this game known as Rampages. Where, like, usually, like, I think those are, like, relegated to Trevor's side of the story. Basically, Trevor encounters someone and they say or do something that, like, really pisses him off. To the point that he just, like, goes on a rampage and just, like, blows everything up, pretty much. There's, like, one mission where the army is involved and you steal a fucking tank, it's crazy. Like, that's, that's not like a main mission, that's like a, a little side quest. But it's a really fucking good side quest, I remember that one well. You could play around before you do the story. Technically going for the question marks is a side quest, that's not the main thing. The main thing is the letter M for Michael. So we need to go back to our manor for the, to continue the story. And now we're in a, a graveyard. Oh, Jesus. Again, I don't mind falling off the vehicle if it's a vehicle this small. If I have to... Someone's gonna have to give me a reminder to change the, the music as soon as possible. Because I feel like this is gonna be... At least for tonight. Again, next time I will have replacement music to stop that shit from happening. Like, sometimes I just play the game and I don't realise that it's happening and then I realise, oh wait a minute, this is, this is forbidden music by Twitch. It is forbidden. God, what does Twitch become these days? Like, I get it, but at the same time, they're like being really draconian about it. Message for me, get off your fat ass. I see this uh, exercise stuff's about as relaxing for you as it is for my wife. No, I don't want to sleep with you, and no, I don't care that I'm 39 and single, it doesn't worry me a bit. Easy. I'm not stressed out at all. Now go fuck yourself. Are you okay? Yes, I'm okay. Just fuck you. All of you. I'm on a run. Yeah, well, you seem a little upset. I could still run you into the fucking ground. <laughs> okay. Hey, I played high school football, all right, sweetheart? All state, QB. Whatever. Just don't have a coronary. Let's go! Huh. Whoa! Yeah, it says it up there. Running does improve your stamina over time. I don't know who I'm more embarrassed for. You're not exactly dressed for cardio. It's running. How much gear do you need? I feel like I'm being chased by my creepy uncle. Yeah, if your uncle was the same age as you, you mean? I like how that NPC just reacted like that, even though I wasn't going into her. I'm not angry. I'm exercising. This must be 
must be so emasculating for you. Yeah, I think this woman needs to take a bit of a chill pill. Run on the road. Take that traffic head on. Yeah, I could have guessed you were one of those. Call the exercise, you lazy idiot. Yeah, it's more aimed at people that just play out. music, but it's still like they've still got like a you know a system in place for like detecting that shit, kind of like YouTube. That's what worries me. Like, because of YouTube, even so much catches as, like, a, a couple seconds of a you song, they will, like, well block adjusted. your video worldwide. And yeah, that's not as bad as terminating your account, but, of course, I'm streaming this on Twitch, and if they, if they really wanted to, they could potentially terminate my account if they're like, oh, wait, they're playing copyrighted music, okay, ban them. But nah, it probably won't come to that, but, you know, you can't, you can't really blame me for being paranoid about it, because that's the kind of shit... That I really don't want to have to deal with. You want to work through some of that shit? Yeah, because you're a walking advertisement for therapy. Screw you, glass ceiling! <laughs> Men suck! I rule! Okay, turns out you can't do that. <laughs> I was just doing that to be funny. Oh god, I've got to do the whole thing again? Shit. Okay, ma'am boobs, race you to the beach. I don't know who I'm more embarrassed for. You're not exactly dressed for cardio. Do I need to be in first place to beat this mission, or is this yeah, optional? Like being chased by my creepy uncle. Yeah, if your uncle was the same age as you, you mean? Although that would explain a lot. Fuck you! So yeah, you've got to, like, pace you yourself. So If I block her, she can't overtake me. Run on the road! Take that traffic head on! Yeah, I could have guessed you were one of those. That space is yours! Own it! Drop dead! Too early! Classic schoolboy error! Oh, fuck. You have such a joyful oh. life! I can't go faster down the stairs. This must be so emasculating for you. You broke my cadence, you fucking moron! Sorry about the Neanderthal! I can't tell if you're loving this or hating it! Okay, here we go, last push! Come on, flick the switch, Marianne, let's go last it! I thought I had issues, but you? You give me hope! I own you! I know I'm taking damage, but fuck it. I should survive this if I just keep doing that. Oh! There we go. Not too shabby, huh? You can have that one on me. I never got out of second gear. I already did a 10k today. Yeah, whatever gets you through it. Oh. My chest. Fuck me. Screw you! You're lucky I'm tapering for a try! <laughs> okay then. We'll have fun with that. Yay, I got 100% completion because I came first. Alright. <laughs> what else can I do? Oh, this is near the pier, isn't it? I think there's like a, an amusement park pier thing somewhere around here. I could go check that out. Yeah, it's down there. Right, okay. Let me go get a, uh, a vehicle so I can get there quicker. Like, I think I've done all the exercise I can for this guy today. I say as I continue to run. Alright. So yeah, this game has a ton of different activities and optional stuff that you can check out. 
like not just side quests, but there's also like lots of little activities and mini games that you can partake in. I believe there's some of them down at the pier there. So um, I guess I'll check out a couple of those and then we'll do one more mission after that. Yeah, I really should, like, at some point just properly listen to that talk show rather than just run off my, my gums talking about other shit. Maybe I'll listen to some of that off the stream, like, just in a YouTube video or something because there's probably a lot of good jokes in there that I'm not listening to. But yeah, Grand Theft Auto 3 had a lot of really funny moments, like, not just the commercials but also just, like, some really funny back and forth banter. Eh, that looks like a, a hipster type yeti. Yeah, he's like wearing like, you know, like, very, like, underground branding shirts. I, I don't know what the word for it is, but you know, like, the stuff that, like, younger people like, that just goes over the head of older people. Also, that is a literal hot dog. I hate when people use the word literally and, like, when they m misuse the word, rather. You could make the argument that I just literally misused the word literally. In fact, I just did it again. God damn it. Sorry, my, my brain... I didn't think that sentence through. Like, you could make the argument that I didn't use the word literally correctly the first time because, yeah, it's a dog, but the sign itself is not hot. But you know what I mean. So there's a Ferris wheel, there's a roller coaster. I think there's like some, uh, what, do, what do you call them? Like booth games, like, you know, like, knock down pins with a baseball, like shit like that. <laughs> I like how they just antagonize you if you so much as look at them. Sprunk. <laughs> Deliciously infectious E. cola. Rain. Is this tampons? What the fuck is that? Snack machine. Oh yeah, I took I took damage running, so I guess I could use this. How do you activate? E hole? No, E cola. You're not pronouncing that right. I don't think I can use that vending machine. Like, I'm trying. Hey, man. Hola. Hola. Uh, this one works. I guess the other one doesn't work. That was nice. There we go. Back up to full health. Little gift shops. Again, this game looks pretty good. Let me check my OBS stats real quick. Just to see how that's holding up. I've only dropped 11 frames of encoding lag or rendering lag since I started the stream tonight. So, all in all, that's pretty good. Like, barely any frames have been, like, lost. Given that I've been streaming for... Coming up three hours now, that is very good. I don't mind losing a couple frames here and there as long as it's like very like minute amount of frames being dropped from the rendering lag aspect of OBS. Definitely holding up way better than my old CPU was. Oh yeah, I didn't really talk about my new PC specs, did I? So for for um, comparison, my old PC was a GTX 1080 with an Intel i7 4000K, I forgot the exact number, 4770, I think. So, yeah, it was quite an old CPU. It was good for its time, like five years ago, but obviously it's starting to show its age at this point. I'm just looking for minigames while I talk about this. 
But I could ride the roller coaster, but I was looking for like, you know, um like actual games that you can take part in and not just like observe. Assuming this pier even has any, I don't know if they do. I thought they did, but maybe not. Whatever, we can just take in the sights while I finish talking about this. So yeah, CPU, uh Intel i7 processor. Uh 32 gigs of RAM, DDR3. And that was pretty much it. I forgot what the motherboard was called. But yeah, it was good hardware for its time. I built that like for four or five years ago. 2016 is when I built it. And it definitely got the job done. It was quite a good PC for a while. But yeah, my new PC specs include obviously the centerpiece being the RTX 3080 Ti, which I did get at retail price. Really happy about that. I got that about a month ago. Only just this past weekend had that installed. Uh, I got a new Ryzen 7 CPU. Um, forgot the exact number, but it's a really good. I think it's 8,000 something. Uh, these will know the number. Like I forgot the exact. I need to like write this shit down so I can really relay the information. Uh, I got another 32 gigabytes of RAM, and you're wondering, well, why did you buy 32 gigabytes more? Because I had to get a new motherboard to use my new GPU, and my new motherboard does not support DDR3. So I had to buy 32 gigs of DDR4 RAM for the new motherboards. So that's pretty much the entire thing in a nutshell. Talk to Jesse. Are you Jesus Christ? All right. Good luck with that therapy. Actually, five thousand X, yeah. I mean, I was sent here to clear things up, and it's not that people don't understand. It's just that people don't understand. Oops. I mean, like, hey, you know, you gotta do the right thing, not the lame things. It's like when you get ten coffees. Okay, and then you get the stickers that say you get a totally free one, man. I mean, that's not cool. Oops. <laughs> Finish the thought, please. I wanted to hear what you were going with that. So, man, I mean, I was sent here to clear things up. And it's not that people don't understand. It's just that people don't understand. I mean, like, hey, you know, you got to do the right things, not the lame things. It's like when you get ten coffees. Okay, and then you get the stickers that say you get a totally free one, man. I mean, that's outrageous. Ugh. Here's something interesting. Try not to be such a buzzkill. For example, when Face me, please. Calls and she really ruins the buzz, and you're all up there on the high astral plane with the big guy himself, and she's like, do your washing. And you're like, but how come we live with a guy that's not even my dad? And she's like, you're special. And I'm like, cool. That's a good shot. Wonderful. Have you ever wondered who I am? Do I still have that on my soundboard? I mean, I'm somebody that's like something that's nope. really far out. It's not there. I, mean, I, I like figured this such. No punch, Jesus. With pleasure. Or I'll jump into him. There's the punch button. <laughs> Eleven dollars. Thank you very much. Ten dollars. Right, so he had twenty-one dollars on him. So yeah, I don't think the mini games are at the the pier, unfortunately. Just like amusement raids. But there is like various activities and like mini games that you can take part in. Again, it's a little bit like Yakuza in that regard. I need to find a car. 2,000 hours later. Golf, tennis, gun range. So this place is called the Los Santos Del Perro Pier. Interesting. I know I said I'll be playing this for like another 30 minutes, but I might play it for a bit longer than that. Like, when I play Minecraft tonight, it will not be a super long session. It may just be about two hours. I want to, like, get a good chunk of this game done tonight. Oh. I'm gonna be using your car. 
future sessions of Grand Theft Auto 5 will probably not be this long. But yeah, let's go do the next mission for now. I'll stop by ammunition to buy some uh, stuff. There it is. You. you seem like you are in prison. <laughs> yeah, I couldn't agree more. And you know who the warden is, Laszlo? Uh, yeah, it's Michelle. Oh yeah, Laszlo, he was in Grand Theft Auto 3's, like, chatterbox. Yes, That's right. Yes, call me a whack job. I think Gra I think Chatterbox was the name of the radio station that had a lot of good back and forth banter. I'd continue listening to that, but then there would be no gameplay, so I'm not gonna like waste time. So yeah, these places are open 24/7, which is great. Yeah, Chatterbox was like a joy to listen to in, in GTA 3. I loved that shit so much. Right, so is the SMG still free? Yep. Gonna take that. Oops, I just bought two. Don't know if I can do wield those. I'm assuming I can. So wait a minute, what happened to my $500,000? Is that for Franklin only? Weird. Not sure what the deal with that is, but... Yeah, we'll buy 10. Alright, see you later, Pixel. Thanks for dropping by. Right, let's go back to my McMansion. Actually, how far away is that? I see a question mark, but I don't know if that's close or not. It's relatively close. I'll go check that out real quick, and then we'll go back to the McMansion. See, that's the joy of, like, open world games like this, like, there's a lot of shit to do, and you'll, like, you'll want to continue the story, but you'll also get distracted and do, like, side things instead. Yep, just crashing into everything while going to that question mark. Okay, that question mark is a lot further away than I realised, but I may as well... Like, at this point, I'm committed to it. Oh yeah, so the left the left stick, right stick, slow down thing doesn't apply to Frank- uh, doesn't apply to Michael. Only Franklin can use that. Also, my car is stuck. I tried backing out there, but the car was like, just jammed between the two other cars. Wow, I am terrible at driving this thing. Yeah. Oh. I'll, I'll help you, sure. Of course, I could run him down. I could, like, run to him. But I would rather run him down. There we go. <laughs> Are you sure about that? $500. I'm assuming that was all the money that he stole. Right, let's go and talk to her real quick. So yeah, random little events like that will pop up, which is not so much a, a, a mini quest or a mini a side quest. It's like a micro quest. Here you go. Oh, you are such a sweetheart. I'm not even from here. Thanks so much. Right, well, I got $50 for doing that, I think. Like, I got 500 off of them, and she Guard, took the 450 oh, back. The groupies, they start to get older and chunkier. And you have that weird fat girl smell. You appear to get oh, 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 oh
Uh, I am not sure if this is the right way to go. Question marks over there. Oh, fuck. Not the best way to do that, but whatever. I, I wasn't even planning to stunt jump there, I just didn't, didn't realise there was like a big drop. Oh! Wonder what that guy's hurry was. Right, here we go. What is... this better be worth it. There's like some really good side quests in this game. Oh god, this guy. About a hotline straight to heaven that this state makes illegal. Yeah, this is what I'm talking about. I don't give a fuck about reefer. No, no, they'd rig the vote. I saw the ballots. It's a lie. It's democracy at work, amigo. Democracy can suck my fatty. Democracy only works when it lets intelligent people do what they want. This, this is tyranny by morons. <laughs> yeah, well. I got things to take care of in a little place called reality. You want to drive? Nah, I'm not a drug guy. This isn't bushweed. This is mana. And I grew up myself. No paranoia, no weirdness. A passport to nirvana. Fuck, give me that. Yeah, here you'll hardly feel it. Yeah, I this is a this fine. is gonna be an interesting mission. It's a pure and yes, this is a mission. But I do get You'll see why. About the monsters. Yeah. I mean, I'm sure they're nothing serious, but uh, oh. I never let them get to you. Oh, the fuck! Kill the aliens. <laughs> yep, he tripping fucking hard right now. So this is not technically a rampage mission, but it might as well be. Because in this one you just shoot shit, or shoot the enemies. With a minigun, no less. I never understood why they call it a minigun, it's fucking gigantic. I am heavy weapons guy. Oh, there's aliens coming from back here. Makes you wonder what he's actually doing at this moment in time, like back in reality. I guess we'll find out in a few moments. Companies push for continued prohibition, which is complete insanity. <laughs> so I take it I can count on your support. The fuck just happened? What are you talking about? We discussed globalization, the state. Stay the fuck away from me. What? But it's a good cause. Yep. <laughs> I do remember that particular side mission. Grassroots Michael. Unmarked. Yeah, I didn't get that one. Alright. 
Yeah, let's go back to the McMansion now. Where's that car? I think I parked it close to that dude's. Assuming the car is even still there, it might have despawned at this point. Yeah, I think it despawned. Right, let's go get another one then. Of course, that's the beauty of Grand Theft Auto. You can just take anything. I mean, that's literally what the game is named after. So, of course, that's something you can do. Ouch. Alright, let's go. I should have written down all of my specs for my new PC ahead of time, but you know what? It doesn't matter. I pretty much said the gist of it. Oh. Just take it. It's thrift store anyway. Yep. Don't make this any worse than it already is. I'm Batman. Alright, he's dead. I will take that, eleven dollars, and... and for once, I'm not being sarcastic. She says as she's running away from me. Couldn't even stand more than a second in my face, like she sees me and she runs in the opposite direction. Alright, now we go back to the McMansion. That's what I'm gonna call it from now on. It's just like a gigantic, like, house. I forgot what Michael's ability was. It may be for better aiming or something, but yeah, for Franklin, it's like better turning in the car. I don't remember Trevor's special ability either. I guess we'll eventually see those as we get through the game. But yeah, like I said, this was like a very ambitious game for its time. Like, coming out at the very tail end of the Xbox 360 and PlayStation 3's life, it's a really fucking good looking game back then, and like, some of the things this game did was like, kind of mind-blowing for its time. Like, for example, like, I can't really show you right now, but when you get to certain parts of the world in this game, you can see mountains like, way off in the far distance and you can, like, go to those mountains. Like, nowadays that's, like, you know, easy for, like, open world games to do that shit. But the fact that this game was able to, like, draw something that far away and you'd be, you'd, you would be, like, sitting there be like, wait a minute, can I actually go all the way over there? Like, 5,000 miles away and go up that mountain? And then you go over there and you realise, holy shit, it's actually something you can do. Like, this was the first game to make me really be like, whoa, that's that's so cool that you can do that. But yeah, we can't really see the mountains right now because we're in the urban area of uh, San Andreas. But there is, like, wilderness and, like, mountains and stuff that you can check out. Right, depending on how long this mission is, this might be the last one I do for tonight, because I'm going to move on to Minecraft fairly soon. want to just stick around in Minecraft for a little bit and see how the RTX looks in that. Because yes, I've got RTX stuff for Minecraft ready to go. For that drink you offered, that's all. I wasn't really serious about that. What? Uh, you're here, whatever. Sit. You're not gonna rob me again. Man, I never robbed you. That was just a repossession. <laughs> okay. 
You can call it whatever you want to call it. I really don't care. What can I do for you? Shit, I just came by to see if there's something I can help you with. I see you doing well for yourself. Look, I'm retired. Ain't you a bit young for the pipe, slipper? We're taking my wife's car. Did I accidentally... Oh, fuck, I skipped that, didn't I? Shit. Oh, so white? <sighs> hey, Jim. Yeah. I'm going for a drink. Dad, wait. shit. I mean, our boat going down the Western Highway. It's... It's been stolen. What? The yacht's been stolen? I, I was trying to sell it. I know you didn't want it sold, but I need money. And they don't want to buy it. They just want to take it. I'm hiding in the head. You're insane. All right, I'm coming. For my boat. All righty, then. Change of plans. My darling boy is in trouble. Hey, I'll help you out. Yeah, I was trying to like move one of the windows about and I accidentally skipped that cutscene, but I guess we didn't miss much since we're doing this instead. Alright, let's go. Lesson number one. Don't ever have kids. Hey man, look, if I had kids, I don't think no parenting issues would arise over who had both privileges and who don't. Shit, motherfuckers would be lucky to sit in a bathtub. Shit, things that desperate, huh? Nah, but, you know, shit, I was making a point. Pathologizing self-deprecation. I know it well. Yeah, man, but shit, where the boat at? Little shit's been hijacked. Oh, so Somewhere this is a really nice car. Highway. Man, ain't you worried? About my boat? Yeah, I am. But you can always buy another boat. Sorry. Oof. Yeah. Tell my accountant that. Man, you can always get credit for one. But have you come repo it? No, thank you. <laughs> All right, homie. I ain't your homie. I'm someone you want Since I can't see it right now, how far well, up does the the Why wanted the star singing thing go? Like, is it five stars because or six I stars? I know in Maybe Grand Theft Auto the uh, 3, the it's like six stars, but I think they dialed it back to five in this one. So I'm gonna help you get this boat back, right? What unfortunate timing for that car to show up. Shit. That's fine, whatever. I don't think that's gonna... Hopefully that didn't cost me. Wait, where the fuck did the boat go? We got a plan? Sure. Once I get us up there close, it is. You're the boarding party. More like the falling in traffic party. You'll be fine. Anything happens, I got a piece of the glove box. I'll cover you. Oh yeah, man, fine. Just oh. So you thought of everything, right? Well, you said you want to learn the old way of doing things. This is the old way. I don't care how much you want to kill these motherfuckers. Don't pop until I say so. I know when the I'm surprised Franklin didn't kid. go fucking flying out of the car because of that. Nah. Hey, <sighs> mind you scraping her shit up like this? I'm not up here for fun, man. Get me near the damn boat. Don't slip now. <laughs> I can't do this shit from here. Get me close. Whoa, whoa. Get up there. Hey, you want me to do this? Oh, fuck this. That did not look like he was going to make that jump there, but come on, whatever. Come on, come on, come on. That looked like he missed by a mile. Come on, kid. Come on, kid. But the cutscene says otherwise. Fuck, kid. Wilhelm scream. I forgot this game used that there. Man the life folks, you pricks! Game! Knock it up, you Use R while holding LB to aim while driving, hold RB to shoot. Uh hang on. Yeah, these are weird controls for driving and shooting at the same time. Okay, now go find Jimmy. Whoa, crap! Dad, wait, you're the guy from the dealership. 
Yeah, and it's a long story, bro. Jimmy! Dad. Dad. Kid, watch out for the boom! Fuck! Hold on! Dad. Help! 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 Ah, this is gonna kill me. Oh, shit, I don't wanna die! Shop back here, dog. You drive us there, we can get the ride fit. My boat. It's just a thing. My boat. Please stop doing that. Listen, I, I fucked up, okay? I I'm not going to lie. That was a really bad judgment call. But shit, Dad, I nearly died. And all you give a shit about is this fucking boat. No, it's not that. It's all we do is scream at each other. No wonder I can't get a job. It's all your fucking fault. Or it's not, but it's partly your fault. I I mean, I just want to impress you. By selling my boat to some gangbangers? I know it sounds dumb when you put it like that, but all you do is daydream or get angry. Look, I love you, Jimmy. But you're an asshole. And right now, with my boat disappearing over the horizon, that's all I can see. Franklin, do you do me a favor and give this kid a ride home after they fix this thing? I want to head by the road in peace. I'm in the call. Oh, great. Leave me with the home invader. I'll get it done, dog. No problem. Dad! Enough, all right? Enough. Hey, Franklin, can you call me a cab? No problem. So wait, how did he know hey, about Franklin invading their house? He didn't see him. One. Los Santos Customs, by the airport. Alright, thanks. Thanks, man. Hey, I'm man, hoping the music that was playing the during that go. whole thing was not loud it. enough to be picked up. Man, I can ask around. I'll let Don't you guys know when I when I stream this game again. Company. Oh. You cover for fire and theft, right? I'm guessing they don't get too many piracy claims on the Great Ocean Freeway, you know? Fuck. I hate paperwork. Hey, so you, uh, do much yachting? Not anymore. No, I don't. Before, I mean, man. No, no, not really. This little shit stays in his room all day, and I don't have any other people to go with, you know? I like looking at it. Looking? Yeah. You know, I come down to the marina. Oh, sit on wait a minute. Dock, pour myself a drink. That's not how you get around there. Jacqueline. Did it clear my head, you know? Let me dream. Jacqueline, huh? Well, maybe you need to do some other shit to fill your time. Dream other dreams, man. Yeah, sure. Whatever. I'm gonna pause the game real quick because I need to move. Sorry, I need to move a couple windows around. Next time I stream this, I'm doing it in dual monitor mode so that this is less of a hassle to deal with. Right. So yeah, I briefly mentioned it earlier, but I will not be checking out Grand Theft Auto 5 online. Not really my thing. I know this dude, man. His name How. He gonna look after. Alright, take what's in my pocket. A couple thousand bucks. That'll cover it, right? Yeah, it should be cool. So you sure you're good? Yeah, I got this. Alright. Ooh, I'm gonna come up front. Get out and walk around. It's okay, I can just climb over. Look, man, I'm gonna get the ride fixed, man. They dropped it back off at your house along with this dude. It's all good though, man. You gonna get your head right, all right? All right. Listen, thanks for today. Appreciate it. We we'll stop back out to the house. We'll talk. Ugh, you see? Show, sure, man. Hey, sorry we didn't get your boat, man. Yeah. Come on, man. Let's trick this whip, homie. 
That was, and I hate using this word, but that was cringe. What he just did there. Like cringe. Right. So yeah, you can do this. You can not only repaint your car, but it also drops your wanted level as well, which is kind of useful when you're in a pinch. Come on, man, let's get in there. For a second, I thought you'd just come here to talk smack about that race you won. Yeah, he's pretty pretty cringe all the way around. I would say that that's a pretty good way to put it. Oh yeah, there's first person mode, I forgot about that. I haven't really checked out first person mode yet, but... So, full body repair. All right. Good as new. So wait, why does Franklin, of all people, have like $500,000? Does somebody yeah, want to fill me in on that one? Dog. Like, you think that would be, like, you know, uh, Michael's money and not Franklin's? Right, okay, respray. Mom was never that hot on the red on Primary color. Can I get green? Wait, can I choose the actual oh, colour yeah. or... Gotcha. Ah, here we go. That's what I was looking for. Secondary colour. Metals. Your gold. I almost ain't gonna be embarrassed to borrow this thing. Tricks with red nets, jumping through hoops, falling in love with lonely zookeepers. We can learn a lot from fish. I think that Apparently the 500 k is from pre-ordering the game. You're stuck with it when you start story mode. Ah, right, that explains it then. Yeah, Franklin. All the credit for our guy. The home invader. You know what? Call me what you like, man. Yeah, I, I, no, I, I mean, sure. Jimmy, ain't he? Or James. I guess Jimmy. I pre-ordered this game on Steam like back in the day. <laughs> nah, man, I'll just stick with Jimmy, homie. But yeah, I double dipped on this uh, game. I, I pre-ordered it for the I'm, Xbox 360, picked it up man. day one. And then a couple years later, I guess I got it on, on Steam. And Papa's all like, he's been down there to talk to you guys. Your pops did more than talk. What'd he do? Look, man, if he ain't tell you... Shit! I ain't gonna tell you. I very I rarely pre-order games, games on Steam. Help me find a new Dude, my dad is retired. Like, fully? Like, so I don't remember if I actually did pre-order this game. Maybe I did, maybe I didn't. But man, look, I'm assuming I, I did, since I have that 500k, so... Who knows? You saved my ass. Nah, nah, man. Well... Well, maybe we good together, you know? Like, maybe we can get shit done we couldn't do separate. If it keeps him out of the house, that's cool by me. Yeah, well, we'll see. Look, I'm sorry my dad lost you your job. It's hard out there. Tough. I mean, I'm employmentally challenged at the moment. Oh, you got fired, dude. Employmentally hey, challenged. Not fired as such. I didn't get a job. I've been there, homie. You've been putting them resumes out there, but no... Oh, jeez. No one's hiring, huh? No, I, uh, I didn't Again, I love the job. way they just pick up their I sentences. I know I keep job. sucking that feature's like, dick, but it's so good. They just kind of disappear. Hey, you play Righteous Slaughter? It's simple, but it's a great way to keep you immersed. Guess we can check out the TV here. Yo, so like, since we're both unemployed, like, we could run together, you know? Yeah, I think about it, homie. Or, or we could just like shop it, you know, play darts or get our drink on, strip clubs. Come on, dude, I get real crazy. Yeah, I got your number, shit. I need it, man. But uh, hey, hey, you know what? Man, go easy on your pops, dog. All right? All right, church. <laughs> exactly, man. My brother from another mother. I mean, I, I hope so, cause my mom was kind of a skank back in the day. See ya. Yeah, whatever, homie. Peace. Again, he is just like, I forgot that, that kid's name, but he, he really fucking drives up the cringe levels, holy shit. What was his name again? 
I guess I'm able to walk in here now without any issue. Hopefully. I don't know, I mean, it's not my house exactly, but I'm kind of curious if I'm allowed to go in here. Nope. Oh, maybe not. <laughs> what the fuck? What's up, homie? Hey, look. Chop got to stay around your crib for a while, homie. That's cool? Yeah, man, it's cool. Shit's the best place for him anyway. <laughs> like it ain't nobody out there gunning for your black ass. Bullshit, nigga. Just take care of it, man, all right? All right, I got you, dog. I'm not sure if I can sneak back in the house. No, the vehicle's not here anymore. You can interact with Chop at Franklin's house. I guess you can pet the dog in this game. Or, you know, you could just watch him fuck another dog. That's also something you can do. So let's see what uh, Michael is up to at the moment. Just fine right here, thanks. Just getting out of the cab that we just saw him in that cutscene. Some missions can be started by specific characters. Michael missions. Okay. I didn't quite catch what that said there. N no. I don't want to start recording, please. Yeah, apparently you can mod money into this game, so it's not really an issue. Gonna have a quick look at the... Like, I'm gonna go back to my mansion and check the TV, because you get some cool stuff on the TV as well. Again, they've got like maybe like a few hours of content on now that you can just like check out and it just like loops infinitely. Oh. Oh, wait a minute, that's Franklin's. That's, yeah. Yeah, I was, go I was going to the wrong letter there. I think you can like set waypoints and shit, but I'm not gonna bother with that. I'm already going the right way. Destroying pretty much every car along the way, it seems like. Ah, nah. That always gets me. Sorry. In short, I understand life and life she understands me. I have been I can't I can't wait to get that video game music into into like the designated folder so I don't don't have to deal with that shit again. Again, sometimes it takes me a while to realise, oh, wait a minute, I'm not allowed to do this anymore. Thanks, Twitch. Sorry, I keep complaining about it. Blame Twitch for that. Man. Blame Twitch for keeping me on edge when it comes to that sort of, Tracy. you know, shit. Yo. I was hoping to check something in the mansion itself, but just walking into the front door just starts the next mission, so maybe not. Amanda! Amanda! You better not be! Not in my house! Fuck you, Michael! Go away! I'm paying that turd 150 bucks an hour to fuck my wife in my own bed? Michael, go away! Oh, I'm sorry, bro. She said you had an arrangement. You and I are gonna have an arrangement. I'm gonna arrange your fucking funeral. I'm really sorry, bro. I'll comp the session. I promise. You are dead, man! Fuck! Dead! Come here! Ah! Dead. What's up, man? Get out of my way. Michael, calm down. What the fuck is going on? Nothing happened. It was a misunderstanding. She fucked a brick in my bed. <laughs> you bullshitting me. It wasn't like that. You in? Fuck it. I'm in. Let's roll. Let's get this motherfucker. Just don't kill him! <laughs> Wait, why that car? Why not the, the really fast car? That was, you know, that I parked like this just not two door. seconds ago. Guys, doing some work for me. He'll get it back. Might have a dead body to it, but he'll get it back. Oh, so we killing this dude? 
You'll wish he was dead. Is that a problem? Shit, a dog shit, shit in another dog. Man, look the fuck out. Shit in another dog. Uh, exactly. Oh. Oh. Shit in my kennel. Fuck. Oh, hey there, Todd. I made that joke already. <laughs> Yeah, I think this is gonna be a retry because of that. Uh, no, I'm still within range. I think I was about to lose them there, but I'm back in range now. Oh, I, th I thought that vehicle was what I was after there for a second. Oh, I remember this. Hey, asshole! You ran off before we could settle our debts. Michael, but you got the wrong idea, man. He's about to have a real clear idea where I'm coming from. There's a winch in the back of the truck. Tied a cable to one of those supports up there. You finna pull his deck down? Hey, that prick pulled my marriage down. Man, you really gonna be this fucking dramatic? Yeah, whatever. I told you I caught the session, bud! Well, there were a lot of freaking sessions, bud! I'm thinking you were working on more than just her backhand! Mandy's backhand has come a long way, bro. But sometimes it's gotta get worse to get better. Yeah, well, maybe I should come up there and practice my backhand! On your face! Oh, bud, your negative energy is seriously bringing me down. Oh, I hope it is, bud! We hooked up, man. You come into my house, take my money, and nail my wife? Are you fucking kidding me? I'm gonna stick up my hand and say that was uncool, bud. My bad. Seriously. Oh, how fucking magnanimous. May I please offer you my applause? You fucking motherfucker! Dude! And we'll see how you like it when someone fucks with your shit. Well, hey. Wait! You got the wrong idea, pal. Whoa! Here we go. Let's do this. Here we go. <laughs> Let's see what happens. Dude, you are probably crazy. <laughs> oh shit! You see this shit, dog? Do it, man. Fucking do it. There we go. Man, homie, ain't grubbing outside tonight, dog. Oh hell yeah, homie. You know what time it is. Oh, <laughs> yep. Completely fucking destroyed. Ah, fucking A. Let's see how he like that. Whoa, man. Fuck, fuck him. And yeah, fuck his deck. Hey, homie. I think you put a little more than a deck down. Yeah, it's a foolish man who builds his house on sand, baby. Hey, man. I don't think my boy Matthew was thinking truck when he wrote that shit. All right, back to Michael's house. Incoming Mr. call. Santa, what the hell? That's not my house. Bullshit. Oh, bro, I couldn't afford a place like that. I'm a tennis coach. I hit balls for a living. I was just hiding there. Give me one. You. You're a dead one. Green light. Green light. Martin Madrazo, give you green light. Oh, I'm scared, lady. Just fucking terrified. <laughs> oh hey, shit. Some mean looking motherfucking essays right behind. You. Oh, that was quick. All right, help me deal with this. I'll give it a go, man. Keep trying. Hey. Come on, kid. There you go. Do I have a better right, gun? Go. Apparently behind. not. Alright, we managed to lose him? Push the pedal, man. We gotta move. Pop that dude. 
Oh, nice. I killed him. Well, I thought I killed him there. We got a book, man. Go. All right, all right. Oh, Although I did kill them. I just didn't kill the driver. Fuck, man. These assholes are me. Where are we on this? Good hey, thing I've got so plenty of bullets. Yep, there's like three different playable characters in this game. This is just two of them. I haven't got to the third one yet, but the third character's like the best. The third character is fucking crazy. I'll just say that. Nice, got the driver. You can tell when you kill someone when the screen very briefly pulsates like a, a, a faint, like, sort of color. It's hard to explain it, but... You gotta use that gun? If you pay attention to it, you'll notice it. We lost okay. Like, everything Go goes a dull colour for a fraction of a second. That's when ah, you know you've killed someone. Shit. You did good. I mean, your aim's all over the place, but you were a help. Ah, uh, thanks. I guess. Hey, don't get the fence. Right, now back to driving. No shooting range. Work on your aim. You'll do fine. Oh, fuck. Yeah, yeah, AI driving good? is not that wine good. Wine. Got a few knocks. You okay? I mean, you did good, kid. Man, I'm cool, man. I mean, you. Mentally. Mentally? Oh, man. I'm fucking excellent. Well, man, you've been kind of reckless, homie. Heart ain't puffed like that in years. Oh, yes. Fucking A, Bubba. Man, you sound kind of manly. You've just been greenlit by the Mexican underworld ambassador to Los Santos. Trust me. We handled it. Wherever the fuck Martin Madrazo is. I've known worse. We just handled a few low-ranking clients. We sit on it, we see what happens. Kid, there's no use second-guessing. Felt good, man. Woo! Yeah, doing something for a change. Ha! Man, you know what? You are wasted sitting by that fucking fool, man. You're right. I need to do I need to do something. Scotch and sunshine is sitting on my ass. Fuck that, I'm better than that. Damn skippy, homie. All that knowledge up there is withering and dying, dog. Bullshit. It's withering and dying, dog. You don't pass that shit on, it's gone, homie. I bet you know some shit. You wouldn't believe the shit I know. Yeah? You taking some score? There was a time, that was all I did. Shit, well, you know, I could tell you some shit, too. Yeah, like what? About this city I was born and raised in. Now think about it. Yeah, do that, man. This could be cool. I just wanted to listen to the rest of that conversation before I advanced. Like, as soon as you reach your des destination, the conversation hey, just stops. Thanks for the help out there today, kid. I had no idea it was gonna get that hot. Shit, pulling houses off the hillside? Show has a weird way of fucking with people. Yeah, well, I thought I was through with all that shit. I don't know what the hell's going on. Oh shit, I think we're about to find out. Do you know who I am? Do you know who I am? Do you? No. Do you? You? I think so. Good. I know who you are. I know where you live. Who are you? I'm Franklin. License. No. Franklin. Maybe help Mr. DeSanta here. Who am I? I think Martin Madrazo. Good boy. Now, maybe give him a little of the background. Man, Mr. Madrazo... It, Mr. Madrazo is a legitimate businessman who was wrongfully accused of running a Mexican-American gang and a narcotic ring, but the charges were dropped because of the witnesses came up missing. Smart kid. Now, Michael, I've got a question for you. <laughs> Did you prove an architectural, significant, modernist, wonder home down the hillside in Vinewood Hills? I thought the owner was banging my wife. Well, that was a strange house for a tennis coach. <sighs> I wasn't thinking straight. Mm, clearly. Yeah. <sighs> well, Natalia will <sighs> need a hotel while you finance the rebuilds, won't she? Sure. Good. And I'm guessing here that 
the rebuild uh, will be somewhere in the 2.5 million range. <laughs> of course. Right. You can start by taking the 500,000 in Franklin's back pocket. <laughs> That's nice. Come on, man. Damn, you I? Never better. So what now? <sighs> Looks like I'm gonna have to postpone my retirement. Fuck. Ah, oh, man, I'm mortgaged up to my eyeballs. Look, I only know one way to make money. I'm gonna have to give an old friend a call. Lester. I think he's in town somewhere. I'm gonna have to track him down. Just give me a little alone time, all right? All right, Bella. I remember Lester. He's quite an interesting character. But I don't think we'll get to see him tonight because I'm about to move on to the next game. Right, let's see my stats. Not a scratch. Uh, didn't make the mission time quota, but I got drive by killer. Cool. Hello. Is this still the number for Lester Crest? Who's asking? Who's asking? Who's asking? You're awful cagey. <laughs> <laughs> Even for a dead man, Michael. Ooh, you don't sound good, buddy. <laughs> Tactful and charming, even in death. Hey, come see me, old friend. I'm living in Los Santos, just like you. Marietta Heights. Whoa, whoa, wait. Hey, how do you... Hello? You fucker. Rapid GT has been impounded. All right. Right, okay then, well, I think... This is a good place to stop for now, so I'm not sure if there's like a, you have to like manually save. I guess you do. Yeah, here we go. So, wait a minute. Where is the save function? I mean, there's auto save. It just auto saved this minute, so I think that'll be good enough. Right, okay then, well, yeah, like I said, that's a good place to stop. I've been playing this for over three hours at this point. Really good game. Uh, sorry it took me a while to, like, get my bearings and shit. Not so much bearings, just, like, forgetting all the core mechanics and the controls and shit. Like, it has been a while since I've played this game. But, yeah, it's, it's still, still is a really fun open world game, and I will definitely be doing more of this uh, at some point this week. And I will definitely be changing the music out i'm going to be getting like if anybody that knows me via dms have any good suggestions for video game music soundtracks to like you know put in this game feel free to hit me up on that and i will see about getting that stuff set up for the next time i stream this